Hello, friendos. Sorry, sorry, I'm a little late tonight, but it looks like only by like one minute. So am I late? I don't know, but we should probably get this party started, right? Let's go. <laughs> hello, 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 everyone. Happy Monday. Happy, happy Monday. Let's go. My sound isn't working. I put my other headphones in. I mean, it's working. I just only have one ear. Hi, Moach. You decided to come say hi to everyone. Oh, look, I'm wearing all black, so we know how this will end. Hi, Moach. Hello, everyone. Yeah, I'll stay I'll stay off of, off of both that and TikTok. Yep, gladly. Moachy, can you maybe not rub all over my t-shirt? I, I love you and I'm happy to pet you, but you don't look. Look at all this hair. Hi, Mace, it's so good to have you back. How are you doing? An industry hello. Goats hello. Shadow hello. I probably miss people. Mochi, okay, we're just gonna have to have a white shirt because he is insistent upon rubbing directly on the shirt. Okay, yeah. Nice, nice. All right, anyway, hello everyone. Happy Monday. I hope you guys have a great start to your week. A great uh, weekend as well. I logged off BG3 to catch a stream today. Let's go. It's gonna be great. I don't think I even downloaded the game, but it's gonna be great. <laughs> also, this is a little much on the music for me today. Let's switch to Punk. Except we listen to that one first every time. Okay, there we go. And a little different vibe, just a wee bit, you know? Sorry, new job next Monday. Let's go. Are you so excited? Are you nervous? How? What are the feels? Where, where are we landing at? I'll try to turn the camera down a little bit so you can see emoji. Just a wee bit. That's better at least. You're stoked? Good. Where's your brush? Did you knock off your brush again? Hmm? I don't know where his brush was. I don't know. I was gonna brush him, but I guess not. But you can at least see his head, even though it keeps blurring him. I don't know why. But I'm so excited for you. I'm so excited for you, Mace. Not looking forward to 4 a.m. wake up again. Ooh. That's rough. That is rough. 4 a.m. wake up is definitely rough. For sure. For sure. I, uh, have been getting up earlier and going to bed earlier. And like not a lot, not getting up a lot earlier, but trying to go to sleep like an hour earlier and uh, getting up, trying to be out of bed by 7 a.m. every day, which my alarm goes off before that. And that only gives me like 40 minutes or whatever to get around, which is usually enough if I get up. But I was doing like 7.30 a.m. and had to be out the door at the very latest at 7.45 and I was never making it to work on time. So we're going to try this. It's only temporary till I get a second rig. Let's go. A second, second rig or second gig? My mods are text typing in mod chat and I gotta see what they're making fun of. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that. A second car. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Got you, I got you. I'm, I'm on the same page now. That makes sense. Cool. Hopefully that'll happen quick, quickly. My mods, I keep reading my mod chat, I'm sorry. Uh, but today we're gonna play Frank and Drink, which I'm super, super excited for. I hope y'all are excited for it as well. Hi Reaper, I can type in here, but it's funny in there. Yeah, it, you're right, it is. And I just am like fully scatterbrained today. It'll be 5.30, still early, oh yeah. So it was at 4.30 because of, or four because of like public transport and such. Yeah, grab your shoes. Reaper has 38 shoes. Let's go. Let's go. Um, Yipper, that makes sense. I'm looking at working at the same place as my sister. However, it's overnight work, which might affect my availability. Listen, you do what you gotta do. We'll figure it out from there. You take care of yourself first. That's always the rule. All the cat hair, because I can't brush him. Uh, gotta catch a bus at 5, then I'll get there by 6.30. Oh, that makes sense. Okay, okay. Yeah. Oof. That's rough, though. I hope you're able to get a car soon so that you don't have to get up as early. That's really rough. Um, there were so many things that I, like, wanted to tell y'all today, and 
I don't remember any of them. I knew I should have written them down, but I've, they're like all out of my brain. But I did just make a TikTok. So if you want to go watch my TikTok, it's stupid. It's, it's, it's so bad. I literally made it in like five minutes as I was getting ready today. Like, and I was getting ready late. So, uh, but if you want to go see my TikTok, like and comment and support, <laughs> it'd be appreciated. I'm trying to, I'm going to try to get better at like all my socials. So that's one of the things I was going to tell you guys. Um, I've been working on a lot of more promotion, especially with, um, gifted keys and some of the bigger games, I want to make sure that I get them promoted pretty highly, um, at least on uh, Twitter, X, whatever, um, and, and I'll likely go back to doing Instagram as well, that's fell off pretty badly, um, but I'll start promoing on there again, and then I'm trying to do a little more TikToks, um, and we'll see what happens from there. Try, not too much, I, that sounds like a lot, and it is a lot, but I'm not going to do, like, it'll all be fairly similar for a long time. Oh no, not a showcase today. Whoops, I should probably turn that off. Today's a gifted key, but it's just not, um, I don't have, like, a have to do a promo link or anything. But let me turn that command off, I forgot it's on there. Hi Danielle, welcome in, how are you doing? I'm very Eminem today. I don't even, I do know what Eminem looks like. I was gonna say I don't know what Eminem looks like, but it just escaped my brain for like two seconds and now I feel dumb, so we're gonna ignore that. <laughs> but uh, is that a compliment? I don't know. <laughs> I'm feeling the vibes today. I'm feeling the vibes. I'd be getting home the same time Mace is going to work. Oh, you're like late, late shift. Oof. Thank you for sharing my socials though, Reaper. Not an insult? Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it then. <laughs> you like my look today? Thanks, Maze. I appreciate it. I'm good. My first day at school is tomorrow, so I'll be lurking. That's okay. Do your thing. Do your thing. Get all mentally prepared for tomorrow, for sure. Do it to it. Um, I guess I could, like, pin my terrible TikTok. Because, I mean, why not? You know? Mochi hasn't wanted to like cuddle all day until this moment. Oh shoot. <laughs> I knew that was gonna be loud. I don't even I don't think I've even logged in. Convenient. Luckily no kids yet, just teachers these first two days. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. She leaves for work around 9 p.m. and they get home around 5 a.m. Oof. That's like a legit overnight, but you would do pretty well with that because you tend to be up through the night anyway, right? Or part of the night anyway? Also could be making that up. Maybe I'll look at this on my phone. It's a terrible TikTok. I really probably shouldn't pin the message, but I don't care. <laughs> There's that. I just gotta find it now. Uh, copy link. And then I'll put it in our chat through Twitch. Maybe I will. Can I go to the chat? No, that's my whispers. Uh, can I watch my own stream? Is that a thing it will let me do? My channel. My stream. Yes. Paste. Watch my new TikTok. There we go. Hey! Wow, Shadow, that was fast. Thanks for that. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. It's a, it's a mess of a TikTok, but... It, I just felt, I feel good about having done it right before stream and just like winging it. So we're going with it. Uh, I most, I used to work 8 to 8, either 8 in the morning until 8 at night or 8 at night until 8 in the morning. The morning shifts were always worse for how tired I was. That's definitely fair. That's fair. I used to work, it was, this was a long time ago, like my first year of college, but I worked at a nursing home and I do like 12 hour shifts or it was 
10 hour shifts. I don't remember exactly, but I, I liked working overnight, but man, I would for sure be tired in the morning. And it was usually, I think I got off at like 7 a.m. I don't remember exactly. I just want to say, love you, Sugi, and thank you for giving me courage to do this new change. Oh, absolutely. I'm so excited to hear how it goes and such. I, I know the first couple of days will be like the workshop stuff, but um, looking forward to seeing, seeing and hearing how uh, everything goes, how you're feeling about it after you get going. No tea tonight. I didn't have time to prepare it is all. Hi. Why are we getting so close in my face? That made me nervous. Okay, back again, but sadly it is grocery time, so I'll be lurking. Okay, no worries. Thanks for lurking, industry. Good luck with the game, Sleeky Raven presentation. Mochi, the nails on your back feet are slicing my legs open, sir. Either lay down or get down. I'll update you all once this first week is done. That's perfect. Industry, have fun getting groceries. Get all the good foods. I need to get groceries. I need to get groceries really badly, actually, but, you know, here we are. Watch his vid, such a little ham. <laughs> uh... uh... What else was I gonna tell you guys? I don't remember. So I'm Whee! gonna go ahead and get the game started. <laughs> we. Because I don't, I don't think I downloaded the game. I'm super prepared, you know? Bo so prepared. Bochi. We want Bochi. It's right here. He's out of focus for some reason because he's not right <laughs> in front of me. You're excited? Good. I'm glad to hear that. I'm glad you're excited. March, 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 march. I just gotta, you know, casually find the game because <laughs> that's where we're at today. It's just, it's just, you know, it's one of those days. I'm getting my act together. My act is definitely not together yet. It's fine. You may not sleep. Oh my gosh, it's so hard to sleep before like a big day and starting like something new. It's so hard to sleep. I totally understand that. I was watching a Oh, I, so I got diagnosed with ADHD officially, and I was watching a TikTok today that was like talking about how um, people with ADHD can tend to like go into jobs uh, like really excitedly and then within a few months like lose all motivation and energy towards it. Um, and I was like, that is so me, like that is me 100%. I've done that like in every single job, which to be fair, I've had some good reasons to burn out quickly, but that is definitely come on strong and burn out quick is like, that's me. Hi Mochi, you're very needy. I swear just cause I'm wearing black and now I'm covered in cat hair. I don't have a lint roller over here anymore either. It's out. All right, the game is downloading. It doesn't look like we're losing any frames, so we should be fine. <laughs> Oh boy. I did put my my earbuds in today instead of my um, headset, so that's something. I did wanted to like have the BB vibes today and the headset would just wasn't doing it. I mean it'd be like that too, but this one I'll try to push through because I don't want to work weekends or holidays anymore. I do not blame you on that. I do not blame you. I think some of it like helps just being like aware of like that's the way I am so I can kind of weigh things a little better and like the PMDD and stuff is always like when I get to that the, there's like a couple days that I'll be like I just want to quit my job and quit everything and pack up and move which y'all know I don't want to do that I do not want to move again and but it's like I just gotta like it's just in my head that everything sucks and I gotta be done so, it's like a great combination, really. <laughs> we love it. We love to see it. This game is a fairly large download, but it has like two gig left. So, we're almost there. What'd you guys do this weekend? Did you do anything fun? 
feel bad for you about your PMDD though. That must suck. I can't imagine. It's not so bad now that I have medications and stuff. Like, it really, really helps being aware of it. Before, I just wasn't aware and it was like super out of control and that was really not fun. But definitely so much better. So, so much better with medications and awareness, therapy and all that. All good things. Ah, there is the game. I'm really excited for this game. I think it's going to be a really good one. It's like where you play in two different periods of time or like two alternate realities kind of thing. But so you're playing in the same spaces, but with different characters, but their lives are connected. I'm pretty excited. I bought clothes, shoes, and then was busy doing things at home. I wanted to wash wax my car, but that didn't happen. That's all right. There'll be other nights. There'll be other nights that you can do it for sure. All right, I am going to go ahead and pause the music and then we'll go ahead and switch over the game since we're, we're good to do that. I think I'll have to, I might have to change the, I think I'll just, just have to change the sound. Perfect. For some reason the sound never wants to change too. I need to fix that, but I haven't yet. I did go to my state fair though, that was fun. I used to go to the Illinois State Fair, but I haven't been in several years now. I competed at the state fair in, um, oh, that's cool, uh, uh, in like cooking and cross stitch for a while. Then after that, I just didn't go back. Oh, gee, can you not get into things? All right, let's do this. I'm gonna put my camera back up. I went Saturday and it was hot and my face got sunburned. Oh, I bet. I bet. It's like all in the sun too. There's some places you can like get a break, but there's not a lot. Headphones recommended for a better experience. Photosensitive warning. This game contains flashes of light that could trigger seizures for people with visual sensitivities. Be aware. Be aware. I wish I could copy that message. I baked like a potato. Oh no. This is a cinematic interactive adventure where your choices have lasting consequences. The perspectives and experience of the different characters are presented through visual storytelling and written documents. A single playthrough will tell one of many possible stories. Only by making different choices in subsequent playthroughs will the whole truth be revealed. Da da da! Oh, the other thing, um, if you guys like if something funny happens or like something deep that you just like really appreciate it doesn't have to be funny or like quirky if i say something stupid or whatever you guys would help me by doing by clipping if you do exclamation point clip or make a clip however you want to do it um that would help me a lot i've got to go back after each stream and feature clips now so it would mean so much if you guys if there's nothing then there's nothing you don't have to just make clips out of nothing but uh if you notice things it'd be very appreciated and hello, Izzy. Welcome in. How are you? How was your weekend? Got to see you. I always be saying something stupid. I mean, same. I can't imagine going through a stream without saying something stupid, but clip everything. Whoa, oh, 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 oh. Clip everything. Did I? Oh, I picked it up. So clips can be made by anyone. Oh, yeah, anyone. Anyway, you can do my command. And you can also just make clips too through the thing. It will come back like this forever. Ask again later. Do I get to keep it? Yes. I like the like the slight shimmering of things. I, ooh, there's a skull on it. A two-in-one to remind you how short time is and how loose your pants are. Yeah, use exclamation point clip. If you're featuring clips, the exclamation clip won't work because it doesn't count for your own clipping. But I can go I can go back and make them though. Like if everybody does exclamation point clip, then I can I can go back and do a No, oh, I can't remember what it's called. The highlight of it. And it should work, I think. Unless that's not how it works, then that's possible too. I mean is use sneaky edit or create a clip it does not work 
So exclamation point clip doesn't do just a marker. It makes like an actual clip. Does that mean it's made for me? Oh, thank you. Thank you about the game music. I forgot the last game we played was really quiet. Oh. Boo! That sucks. Uh, okay, so you have to make a real clip <laughs> through the actual Twitch settings then. Dang, so I can't make clips and feature it then. Oh, that's gonna be terrible. I'm just never gonna have any featured clips. <laughs> no, oh no. Okay, well, that's fine. That's fine. We're not gonna let us keep, keep, let it keep us down. We could try it. I'll just, if somebody does exclamation point clip eventually, like don't do it now. I could, ow, mochi. Okay, if you're gonna be a pain, you have to be down. Covered in hair? Well, that that's what I'm thinking. I could do the, um, if I did the marker, then I'd still be the one making the clip and it wouldn't let me feature it is what it sounds like Goats is saying. That took me forever to watch those, walk those few steps. Oh wait, can I not? Oh, okay, yeah, I can. I think they have to be actually clipped by the individual person is what Goats is saying. Uh, priorities are to do some word search. Groceries, coffee, cereals, pharmacy, buy Omega, play card games, stuff to fix. We got the wheel. Clip feature thing is trash on mobile, I think. It's frozen my app a ton this week. Yeah, that's the problem. If you actually clip it, then yes. But with exclamation point clip, it's technically sleeky clipping it. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know what to do about it. I guess we'll just see what happens. Uh, Monday. Last night's adventures featured me sitting on top of a winding dune on a scorching sunny day. Then it seemed to dissolve into me sitting on the edge of a dock on a rainy night. Can't see a thing. The sunlight hinders my sight, and at night the heavy rain does the same. What was I looking at? Tuesday. Quiet night, nothing to note. Maybe I'm just too worn out from my daily duties. The only thing I remember is feeling someone caressing my head in absolute silence. It's creepy. <laughs> Wednesday, pitch black. The sound of my heavy breathing and the heart rate monitor, the inky dream land was punctured, beep by beep, and then I was awake. Cross the wheel off. We got groceries, we went to the pharmacy. So we have to do a word search, play games. We still need rope, a little chain, and lenses. Go to our notes. Can't be me. Mm -mm. Uh, victories and struggles struggle my left eye hurts at night and I can't control or increase my stamina victory though is ham's happy with me linda's helping me out with sophia and jerry underdog's health is under control uh one year anniversary at the dead end building every time i make eye contact with underdog the connection is so strong i feel like i've always known him I had this deja, strange deja vu feeling when I passed by the city clock today, like I had been walking past it my whole life and other places too. I'm sure I used to live in the city. I believe this is some kind of progress. Graffiti. One, first there was a mission. Two, then the worst happened. Three, someone you know has crossed the line. Four, you have something that belongs to us. Five, it will change the world. Six, we need to find it. Seven, only you know where. All right, all right. Now we go through the door. Let's check our mail. 3A. Unravel the message. The pillow reader. Want to know what's hiding in your subconscious? The pillow reader with more than 40 years of experience will guide you through the intricate world of dreams to find the key. Call now. Uh, now to... For, Two by one in one. I don't know what that says. Sweet dreams, happy life. Oh, well, could have just clicked that. I never checked that first. Uh, but oh, wait, I didn't click on that one. Does that have a, oh, okay. I did click on it. <laughs> Bug out, keep your home pest free. Uh, Frank. 
open. Wait, wait, wait. How do I open? Okay, no, but how do I open this? Open. Open! <laughs> okay, well, I guess I can't open it right now. What are these flyers? Oh, we added our stuff to the flyers. Makes sense. Makes sense. Healthy paw animal care. Now 20% off. Inking out. Get some tattoos. $20 small tattoo. Man, mine cost $100 for a small tattoo. I think I got ripped off. That or those are cheap tattoos that you don't really want. Um, what's this? Who lives here? We're Frank and 3A, Linda and 2A, James and 1A, Patrick and Aubrey and 1B, and Sophia and 2B. Those are cheap. Fair enough. Chinese food, certificate of inspection visits, auction, farmer's market. Please keep the door closed. Want to take a trip down memory lane without having to wake up at 7 a.m. on a Saturday or eat diabetes inducing cereal? If you're a fan of the Golden Age cartoons, no one understands. Can I take one of these? No. Why you're stuck in the past. The meetup is right up your alley and, well, this takes place in an alley, but not to worry, it's a safe haven full of cartoons from the 50s and 60s to watch and talk about. Give me a ring. Sure. Uh, let's go upstairs. I like this art, art style a lot. It's like 15 years ago pricing. Fair enough, fair enough, wait. They didn't want to talk to me, apparently. I shut the door. One more. So we're in 3B. This game looks cool. Love the art style. Me too. Oh, we're in 3A. That's right. Thanks for petting and berry. Gosh, so cute. Why do I have numbers on the back of my neck? Or, or letters? I can't tell. Hi, Frankie Hun. How are you, love? And what's and how's Underdog? That grizzled old tail wagger. Everything going smoothly in the building? Is there something to sign? Anything that needs buying? The fact that I keep quiet most of the time has nothing to do with indifference, but with my complete trust in you, uh, you do your job. Your job is to clean, I guess, diligently, and you're always ready to shoulder more responsibility. I'm proud of you, proud of what you've accomplished despite your situation. Keep in mind what we recall during our life is nothing but mental reconstructions, collages of how things were and how things are now. They are distorted and unreliable. Just stories suit the self, but you're writing new stories and forming new collages just from a different starting point. You'll be just fine. Uh, but may I, but maybe you've noticed I'm kind of beating around the bush. I have some news for you. I'm sorry for the short notice, but you're going to have to make space. Uh, what? For a new roommate, Drake Lambert already has a set of keys and arrives tonight. Rest assured you should, two shouldn't butt heads since you'll probably never bump into each other. Drake only works night shifts. Remember, my dear Frank, several things in life several things in life liberate the heart and lead to lasting peace. Making friends is one of them. The others, well, I think you have them covered. Listen to this old coffin dodger. I learned these things the hard way. One last thing, your new roomie specifically asked for a bedroom with no windows. Namaste, ham. I don't, I could choose my job or to make space, but like the, the gun situation makes me nervous because I don't really know, I don't really know what these choices are. I don't know what this thing is. It's just a power box. This is a cardboard box. I don't know what this is and a gun. Vampire for sure. 
Need a silver bullet? Is that what you're trying to say? Uh, what should I choose? If I make, I can either go get to work now. Or make space for a roommate, it sounds like. You guys have thoughts? Hi, Nixus, how's it going? How are ya? It's good to see you. Sorry, I got distracted by a message. I wanna make sure that wasn't important. Um, I'm gonna choose my job because I don't really know what the other means and I'm nervous about the gun. So. Tree. We chose our duties over preparing our room. So that's one of the like choices matters then. Um, Pretty good, got some Nautica below zero on sale for $10 on Switch. Let's go, been playing it all day. Are you enjoying it? Well, I'm assuming you're enjoying it then. Is it is it like what you expected? Or what are your thoughts? I haven't played it. Food away. Make some coffee. this to do it all at once. That game looks like it would scare me to death. Subnautica? Whoa. Those whole beans turn into ground coffee that sifts through your fingers like memories, but if you look carefully, you'll see some of it has clung to the creases. Hmm. Ocean gives me a big nope. That's fair. Hello, good to see you. Welcome in, welcome in. How are you? How was your weekend? In the state you're in, I give you superpowers, and in exchange, you betray me by going to a coffee shop. I know you went there yesterday morning. I can still smell the cinnamon on you. Uh, cabinets? So far, I think I like the map of the first game better. This one is smaller from what I've seen so far. Ooh. So a little less, like, content and such in it. Oh, this is us putting our groceries away. Right, right, right. Coffee. You sometimes mistake your coat rack for an intruder, so it's just a natural step to start listening to advice from cartoon animals and clothes. I'll go first. Be careful around your new roommate. Yikes, that seems a little foreboding. Yeah, he's right. Due to your situation, you can easily be taken advantage of. Find a way to get to know him better, even if you won't get a chance to meet him in person. We all know it's about time you start making real flesh and blood friends. I'm good, been getting a lot done, and today I've been cleaning the apartment, nice. Are you feeling good about progress then? Plug in. We used the popcorn machine that got me achievement for a movie watcher achievement. Let me see these words. Sorry, I don't have anything of value to add. You did just come for the popcorn. <laughs> uh, yeah, 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 sure, sure. French? Dear Dairy, <laughs> that's funny. You have one day left before things get sour over here. Oh, oh, okay. Just seen the weird AF octopus jellyfish thing they found under Antarctica. I think it has 20 arms is scary. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that's no, that's a hard pass for me too. I think I would enjoy the game though. It just seems like a lot of time. I have to like be so picky about what I play. Yeah, I'm feeling very productive, which is a nice change. I love that. I love that for you. That's so nice when that happens, like when everything like starts settling in. You find your rhythm. Comes and goes, I think. That's our face. Fish oil, omega-3. I can help with your eyes, your heart, and even your brain. Who knows? Maybe I'm the answer to all your problems. Imagine if it were this simple. Didn't you forget something this morning? Probably. 
I mean, imagine forgetting something. Couldn't be me. <laughs> we just listen to ourselves pee. Not gonna pretend like that was comfy. <laughs> we did a little, we did a little pee and now we can wash our hands. Yes, wash our hands, use the soap, get real clean. Good. We needed to like dry our hands. I guess not. This is still clickable, but I think that's just the way they've all been. All right. Um. So now what? Oh, I can go out this door. Nice. Keys to the basement. Guessing is where I do work things. So I'm guessing I won't have a great relationship with our roommate since we didn't really make room for him specifically. Pretty light. Oh. No? No light? Uh. Power box. Oh, light switch. Just kidding. Is there a power box? <laughs> These are meters. Ah. What's more important to you? Being a good Samaritan and having to go to a laundromat every now and then, or playing it by the book? Just to let you know, there's a baby at that building. Oh. Uh. I don't think it's gonna let me click away. I think I have to do it. I have no option. Uh, I'm real sorry. I'm very sorry. Wait, why would I not? Connect it back. Already did the laundry, right? Sorry, family. Oh. It legit just like won't let me do anything if I leave it there. Well, I'm very rude. But that's how I get my light, I guess. I don't have a screwdriver. Assembly guide. So they'll have to go, the screws will have to go in that direction, but. Shadier, hello, welcome in. How's it going? How was your weekend? Light. Shads, thank you for lurking. Thanks for popping in. Relax, lower Frank's anxiety level. We are used for healing and to help communicate with the departed. I'm surprised you know that. Now squeeze. And heal. How long will it let me do this, do you think? Thanks for shouting out Shads. Uh, that's a creepy picture. Hmm, you look familiar. Probably because I put it there? Read. Reducted, cease the burn, enjoy the chill. Is that like antacids, coins? Squeeze, yeah. Want to work on that memory of yours with this gorgeous Bavarian deck of cards? That was on my list to do. There should be more humans around. Can you help them, help me find them? Oh gosh, I'm gonna have to play cards, and I don't know. Okay. Did I 
into it, right? Okay, I've gotta find I've gotta find the humans, I think was the plan. So I've got one on the top left and one on the middle. Okay, I was gonna say it's the exact same, but no, there's one more. There we go. Lulu, hello, welcome in. How's it going? How was the teacher's Hello thing? there. Hello there. How'd the, how the meet the teacher thing go for you? Oh crap, I've already forgot one. Oh, I messed it up. No, I gotta start over. Gosh dang it. I knew I'd get distracted. Can we flip cards more quickly, possibly? I gotta do this whole deck correctly in one go, apparently. So one, four, seven, nine. One, four, seven, nine. One, four, seven, nine. Nice. I think the kids liked it. I found their lockers and set up supplies. Nice. That's fun. Three, four, five. Distraction. Yes. Three, four, five, seven, nine. Three, four, five, seven, nine. Nice. Sometimes you need to work your way up. I don't know what that means. One, two, three. Am I supposed to find the opposite now? Like four, seven, I think. Okay, that was right. Whew. <laughs> Yikes. Are they happy with their lockers, Lulu? Two, four. Two and four. Two, four, seven. Uh, two, four, eight. Two, four, eight. Two, four. Two, four. Uh, okay. Wait. How long? Uh, I played cards. Does that count? <laughs> Why did it restart randomly? Because I did it wrong? tape. Okay. How convenient. Did you know that a fatberg, a rock-like mass of waste formed by wet wipes, fat and grease the size of a Boeing 747 was discovered in a drain in London? And can you tell me why, instead of anything that might be useful, you end up remembering stuff like this? I mean, it seems like useful knowledge. It seems like useful knowledge to me. Yeah, they set up shelves, mirrors, and magnets. I love that. Setting up my locker used to be like one of my favorite things. I had to have so much organization. Vandalism removed. Roof inspections. Oh, I can do one or the other. Is that what we're saying? Let's do... Roof inspections. Check thermostats. Had to get a P had to get PE uniforms too. Caden outgrew his and Nessa just got a set. Oh nice. PE uniforms are not my favorite. But you know, they're a necessary evil, I suppose. We chose rooftop instead of graffiti. Can I turn these off and like oh no. I can only turn off one. Farbergs? Did I say- was it Farbergs and not Fatbergs? I- didn't it say Fatbergs? Now I'm gonna have to go check. I thought it said Fatbergs. <laughs> Did it really not? Will it tell me again? It does say T. There's a T. Oh, is that what you were saying? Is that was just funny? And you were correcting yourself? Yeah, that was weird. <laughs> All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's go, uh, what's under here? Oh, I just went up the stairs. BRB water, do your thing, Chad. Do it, do it. I should've, I did bring my water. Man, I was really not ready for stream today. 
Let's check these roofs. This seems not healthy. Oh, now I have a screwdriver. Yeah, no fun. Nessa will probably bring a brush, deodorant, perfume with her too. Gotta find PE clothes bag. Yeah. Never the fun. How is a sewer in London the size of a 747? I mean, that's also a great question. We should definitely plunge this. It's looking better. Nice. Now there won't be any leaking roofs. We come from broken homes, and you? What's your story? This is gonna get deep. I can tell this is just, this is gonna be deep. Wait, do I not have to put the screws back on? All right, all right. I hope it lets me go put the power back, that I didn't like miss that opportunity, because now I'm worried that I didn't, oh gosh dang it, I didn't get to go put the power back. Nuts. Let's go potty again. You can listen to me pee. You're welcome. <laughs> Hope you all enjoyed. We're gonna wash our hands down. You're so tired. Did you have a long day? Oh wait, can I not wash my hands? What's happening? Uh, hello? Hello? Okay, turn the water back off. Uh, I'm stuck. Oh wait, we're gonna brush our teeth instead of brushing our, washing our hands apparently. Hmm. Munted? What's that mean? Munted? Do we have to pee again? We really had to pee. Been drinking a lot of water. Oh, it's just gonna want us to brush our teeth again. Okay, we're just gonna, we're just cursed. Ah, indeed. Okay, so we only had to do that once. That's fine. That's fine. What, I mean, you're supposed to brush your teeth twice, right? Okay, we've already done these. Do I not need to do these again? Oh, can I take fish oil this time? It's open. Well, hopefully I took it. Now we can leave the bathroom. Did this go outside? No, it's to our bedroom. Nice. There's a loading thing behind, uh, Barry. I just realized that it's kind of covered. Set out our desk. Oh. Just sit in the chair. Oh yeah, okay, desk. Skincare. I wanna do skincare. <coughs> <coughs> Look, just like your mind, a dome with swirling bits of information that have yet to settle. And in the middle of a storm, a house with no lights. Is it vacant or is it filled with ghosts? Mood. Journal. Week 52, Wednesday. My mind keeps wandering to that lost and found box on my desk down in the basement. The thought that at some moment in time it was filled with, with things worth searching for, but now all that remains, the lost mitten, empty disposable lighter, broken umbrella, will be inside that box forever, accumulating dust and fading deeper into the land of oblivion. A bit like my memory right now. Someone or something took all my precious possessions and left only the useless stuff. Everything I need, everything that binds me as an individual, was taken away from me. My real name, knowing if I'm alone in the world or not, if I was good at something. Yeah, I love projecting my thoughts onto objects. It makes me feel less lonely and provides some sense of control. Fake, but comforting like most things in life. Ham insists this is an opportunity to be someone better. Perhaps she knows more about me than she's letting on, and I'm better off in the dark. So what if this is a second chance? But then again, what good is a second chance if I don't know what went wrong the first time? What would stop me from making the same mistakes all over again? I feel like some soul snatcher switched mine with a bogus one that can't quite blend in. And my real soul is out there, who knows where, trying to find its way home. Each day for the past 52 weeks, I gathered random thoughts that don't even feel like my own, from dreams, glitches in my mind, new smells, anything. Anything I could retrieve and note down that would help me in the process 
all for nothing and never left square one. Anyway, I can't complain. It could always be worse. So today, I got some big news from Ham. Someone is coming to live with Underdog and me. The only thing I can tell you is that Drake Lambert, name of the new roommate, works night shifts and wants a room with no windows. Strange request. Now I feel bad I didn't prepare the room for Drake and shutter that window. At least I left a note to search for the key in the library. I don't even know what's in there, but I'm sure it would have taken every bit of my limited energy I chose to work instead. On top of everything else, I discovered someone is stealing electricity from our building. I had to put a stop to it because Ham trusted me with the building, and above all else, my job is to keep it safe and running in the best condition for all the people who live here. Munted is Britain's slang for drunk, stupid, dumb, Australian, New Zealand slang for intoxicated by drugs or alcohol. Oh, munted. Got it. I'm going to try to remember that. Then I had to unclog the drain pipe on the rooftop and came up upon a different scenario than usual. Despite my amnesiac condition, I never forgot forget to lock doors at that roof, and that rooftop was unlocked. And then the pistachio shells. The only people with access to the rooftop are Linda, who goes there to feed the Orioles with fresh fruit, and me, to perform my superintendent duties. Or maybe Linda also feeds the birds with pistachios and I'm paranoid. Hi, Mochi. Try to give my brain a workout by doing some memory games with the funny deck of cards. Damn, it's hard, which made me wonder if I should leave Drake a plain set of instructions or just let him figure this out, things out on his own. One last thing before I call it a day. It's been a year since I woke, woke up in this alley. A whole year since I began working and living in this building with only Sophia, Jerry, and Underdog as fellow residents. Gradually welcoming the new tenants while doing my best to keep the building a safe and clean space. A new life, all thanks to Ham's kindness. Happy birthday to me. Good night. Okay, wait, what are we doing? Uh. Oh, ouch, ow, ouch, ouch. <sighs> oh, she's killing me with his nails. Okay. You can't fight me for hurting me. Or I mean you can, because you're going to anyway. Stupid cat. <laughs> Alright, uh, can we leave a note on this too? Oh, I can only pick one thing. Let's do this. We want that to be a note to Drake. Oh, I accidentally clicked out of the game. Um, uh, okay. <laughs> Who's going to the rooftop without permission and is clogging the drain pipes with pistachio shells? We check the rooftop. We play the card game. Okay, I think that's it. Ooh, look at our eyes. I didn't notice that when we looked in the mirror. What's the back of our head say? Doro 88 or something? Alice, hello! Hi friend, it's good to see you. Pistachio shells are nice are nice tools. Tools? What do you mean? Are pistachio shells tools? Oh, I freezer. Put it on the freezer. I'm sorry I'm late. I was at dinner. Oh, no. No worries. No Wee. apologies necessary. Wee. Grab our coat. Get that note. I require dinner, sweet and sour chicken on rice, TV dinner with a bowl of fruit, watermelon, some canned sliced peaches, grapes, strawberries, and some banana. That sounds so good. I'm here for that, Nexus. What do we just inhale? Oh, we, we gone. That's, we got drugged. Pistachio shells can be used for pista opening pistachio shells. Fair enough. Fair enough. So that, that letter that had our name on it just, we took the red pill. It's essentially what happened. Looking extra cute today? Thanks, Alice. I'm sure you're looking extra cute today. You always look cute. I tried doing more eyeliner today. I like it. Drake. 
I love you. What a coincidence. What's happening? I feel like Theseus, Theseus in the maze about to confront the beast. The beast. We're like walking in the opposite direction that uh, Frank did. Oh, those eyes be following me. I know Allie's get a bad rap, oof, but this one seems very well kept. The Odyssey, I guess so. I guess so. Time to go inside. Except for this troubling graffiti. Can't tell if it's a threat or a self-improvement quote. Only you know where. Hmm, a Somali headrest. Also considered a symbol of vigilance. Did that graffiti cat leave it behind? Finders keepers, as they say. Huh. There's a note over there. Come on, Drake. What more do you require than a roof over your head? There you are, Frank. It's nice to put a face with the name. Oh, so this is our roommate. We're in the same world? Just never gonna pass each other like real life. Top floor sans elevator. My predicament can't get any worse. And they were roommates. <laughs> yes, <laughs> obviously it can. Imagine walking in to meet your new roommate and there's a red haze around the room, orange haze, and a dog barking. And your roommate's nowhere to found. And this odorous orange gas. Well, the dog seems fine, so it can't be toxic. Maybe Frank employs the use of unusual incense to ward off bad energy like Mother used to. We'll check the fridge. Hello, welcome. This apartment will be shared will be shared accommodations. Please respect the following house rules. The common areas of the apartment must remain clean and tidy. Please keep all personal belongings in your room. It's indicated with a sticky note. Cleaning supplies are under the sink. We must clean the apartment weekly. I'll make the monthly schedule according to your night shifts. Uh, since we won't see each other, we'll also share underdog's care. Take him for a walk after work. I hope you have the evening off so you can settle in. Thanks. Ooh, should we go, should we work our night shift or should we take the evening off? Looks like. I'm not sure what all we do. Like a bar maybe? I don't really know what this is. Work at a restaurant of some sort, bar of some sort. And then this would be watching a movie. What do y'all think? I think well let's work the night shift. We made we made a uh, Frank work. So might as well It's a bar. Okay. Go to the bar or the cinema. F work. Oh, too late. Too late. <laughs> what a warm welcome. This must be a boarding what boarding school feels like. Life is starting to make me appreciate my homeschool upbringing. Oh. We don't have a great bond. <laughs> Well, I kind of saw that coming, though. Strange sleep schedule. Maybe he's as old as the dog, and the whole building is, in fact, a nursing home. Or a poor version of the Bramford. Hope they don't die on my watch. Welcome back, Shadow. Word search. What would he do if I found one of his words? I think we should. Hmm. Let's do a bookstore. Oh, Samuel Bookstore, whoops. 
Did I solve the whole thing? Oh, let me do that. All right. I mean, I'm not mad about it. Good cat. Uh, Greenbridge Creek. Uh, wait, no. We got bear hut, bug out. Bear hug. Gardens. Uh, Emperor Theater. Oops. Too far. Um, uh, something reader, the pillow reader. Got it. Uh, let's see. We have brown cookies, everlasting pretzels. We should be able to find that one pretty easy. Anybody like word searches? I used to love word searches. I haven't done them in a long time. Healthy paw. You love them? That's awesome. Do you get to do them often? What's up, Dewey? How's it going? Welcome in. I do them when camping or trying to relax my mind. I like that. I like that too. That's a good idea. Uh, we got brawn cookies. Not in a while. Fair enough. Fair enough. You okay? It's been a rough weekend. Is your is your week starting off any better? Or was it the week that got things off? Mm -hmm. I have a lasting pretzels. Old chestnut. Uh, what else do we got? Sir, suburbia laundry. <laughs> suburbia lawn laundry. And then healthy pa. Busy week in that work, and now I'm looking for a new place to live. Is that like exciting or just stressful? Sometimes that's really stressful. Healthy pa. Healthy pa. Pa. Yep. Did it. We completed the word search. Love that. Love that for us. I can't I can't click on these. I guess that would have been if I chose to stay home. Let's go to my room. Drake's room. The key is somewhere in the bookcase. Oh yeah, we gotta we gotta look for the Is this some weird memory? I could swear this thing turned on by itself. Weird. Over two hundred pizza out the door yesterday only? Oh my goodness, that's a lot of pizza. Again? I wasn't brought up in the woods to become a lily-livered craven. Try harder. This seems like a good place for a... Just kidding. Tam shop or something like that? Wait, what am I supposed to do? Oh, can I lift this part? Ah, there we go. Makes sense, makes sense. Wow, these, these heads are giving off some nasty vibes and ruining the feng shui. I'll better be off with them, facing the wall. Can we face the wall? Oh no, they won't let us. We'll be better off, oh, there we go. Better off with them facing the wall, there we go. Love that. Now we have the key to our room. Unlock. It's kind of interesting that they didn't just put the key in the room and leave the door unlocked. I don't know. Seems strange. 
Ooh, we have even less of a bond. Oh, because the room's really not very clean. Oh, my stars and garters. Water beds do exist. I'm in shock. And I work at a bar in the middle of nowhere at night. I need to take care of that window before it becomes a problem. Maybe we are a vampire. Maybe Drake is is a vampire. Oh, the gun. Sadie! Hi, Sadie! Welcome in! Oh, thank you. Thank you. I tried. I tried a little bit. Just a wee bit. This room is full of surprises. Yes, the gun. That's what the gun meant. So we just... Can at least one of them be good? Sadie, that's what I told her too. That is indeed what Alice told me too. Give me that shoe. Get it. Get it good. All the things. Okay. Uh, that's a journal cover if I ever see one. First creature of the night. Osseus Otis Long-Eared Owl. Historically nested in this region, but no breeding birds have been seen in a number of years. Yeah, interesting. So many cuties, right? What's going on with this? This. Looking weird. Uh, let's look at our cards. Guess the movie. Line. Go quickly, travel safely, my young friends, to the land of ghosts. Knock on Hossmackler. I don't know how to say that. Even the people in feather beds ain't satisfied. The boy. I don't know how I'm supposed to know how to guess that. Uh, decide your own life. Don't let another person run or rule you. Don't take advantage of someone who is in a vulnerable situation. Always try to find work, even if temporary. When no employment is available, be a self-starter. <coughs> I'm not going to get water in a second. Um, always respect nature. Do not leave garbage around. Be mindful of others. Help all runaway children and try to induce them to return home. Help people whenever and wherever needed. You may need their help someday. Whether for or against the cues, always lay in your voice. If in a community jungle, always pitch in and help. Oh, whoa. <coughs> I'm gonna go get water. Give me one second before I start coughing my head off. Please hold. Okay, okay, I'm back. I have water. And I'm probably gonna have to drink it more. Can you tell how- you can kind of see how cat hair covered I am since Mochi rubbed all over me twice now. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, y'all. I got like a tickle in my throat while I was talking through that note. No, it doesn't want to go away. It's making my eyes water. Alright. So these are like symbols, symbols that mean something specific. Oh my gosh, so much cat hair. I hate being covered in cat hair. Which is like contradictory to getting a cat. But you know, it is what it is, I guess. I should know better. Okay, mom's game. For each symbol you find inside or outside the house, you'll get a new book. not certain what that means. Ooh, we play the harmonica. Okay. Not mad about it. Not mad about it. Emergency kit. I hate it when I have to use this. Well, hopefully we won't. No one ever noticed that this picture is actually a painting. Feeling good. No knee yet. Hmm. Such a pity, but not today. 
Oh, the movies. That's what we would have done if we didn't choose to work. Oh, I missed this tab. Except there's nothing on it anyway. Um... I'm assuming that I need to figure out these cards. Go quickly travel safely, my young friend, to the land of ghosts. Are these quotes that you guys recognize? Should I know? Because I got nothing. Homo ethical code. But I can't like click away from any of this. What, should I turn this? No, there's no option to. I got nothing. I don't know what these quotes would be. I thought maybe I could find it like in rooms around, but it doesn't seem like it. won't let me out of this space until I do something else. So I'm missing something. Oh, wait, now it'll let me click on this. Oldest, old Chestnut, Drake Lambert. Let's go to the place where everybody knows my name, but say Jack serves the best beers. Okay, there we go. Now we got it. We're going to work. Working on that shift. Work, 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 work. Covered in cat hair. I wish I had a lint roller. I need to get find where I put my not paper one. Estamos aquí. Can I talk to this dude? No. Okay. Yeah, Sadie's here. Or at least was. She may just be popping in and like you. Hats, scarves, shoes, vintage clothing. Today, 30% off. Tattoo parlor, in and out. I'm curious about this. Wow. Who turned up the volume? Noisy city. I'm curious about um, this animation style. Uh. I don't know if it matters which way I choose. I'm assuming that's probably one of my choices matter things. This looks like one of those hobo symbols. I have no idea what I'm doing right now. Can't click all of them is what it's saying. We won't do the middle one then. Circle and a square. Weird. Starfish! Hi! Welcome in. How are you? If it isn't that odd, I'll vest pocket all grown up. How's life treating you, Drake Lambert? I reckon you must be all confused that it's that a nasty crippled down and out knows your knows you and your mama. Well, I was there when you was born, quiet as a church mouse without a hint of a whimper. I see that nothing's changed. Weird. I'm really itchy. I got bombarded by mosquitoes. No, that's the worst. Do you have any of those um, acne patches, the pimple patches that you can like that you'd put on your face? I've heard that those are really good to put on, but like mosquito bites, bug bites in general, because they'll like pull the stuff out of it. I don't know that it helps. Like I'd put like some itch cream probably on it, let the itch cream dry, and then um, I'm so covered in cat hair, uh, and then uh, put one of those on like each of the spots if you have any of those. I haven't tried it myself. I just saw that tip recently, so you'll have to let me know if it works. <laughs> 
but I heard good things. Uh, we all felt something was off about you, but that faded away soon as we saw the happiness in your ma's face. But what the hell do I know after so many years living by my wits? After hundreds of miles in boxcars, riding the rods without ever wearing out my welcome? I don't give lessons or take partners, but let me deliver this here message to you. My service sex, so hopefully I can hang out for more than a few minutes. But how's the game? So far, it's really good. I really like the art style um, a lot. It's been nice. Um, I'm not entirely sure what's going on yet, but so far, I like it regardless. You're in real danger, and the threat that looms over you is as deep and dark as the night sky. Keep your eyes on the signs and mind your P's and Q's. Time for me to hit the road. So long. Mood? That was a weird interaction. Little Lawrence Weenie. 60770. So this is like. Is this in the future or is this in the past? I assume it's the past. When I, whatever I inhaled at the apartment has got me tripping really bad. What on earth just happened? The ear splitting sounds, old hobo holograms, creepy objects come to life. Am I losing my mind? Okay, that's what I was asking. That's a huge plus. Art style is one thing that usually grabs me really quickly. I agree. And like sometimes if it's too cartoonish, then I'm like not here for it. But this has been, I, I am like, it. I was just talking about how I really like to know the animation style, like how they animate this like do the drawings and animation because I'd be very interested in learning it. Yes, everything looks like the old usual crappy night at work. Just what I need to keep my mind off those weird sightings. Oh. <laughs> this is a bit fishy. Da -da 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 -da. How's being old? <laughs> Oof. Daily activity log. To you, Drake, my favorite coworker. When the night has come and the way is dark and the moon is the only light you see, you'll see that Fred Abbott is already gone ski. Hammered, meaning pretzel plate and home. Uh, James, pretzel plate and home. James, your turn. Sorry. There's a clogged toilet in the men's room. Your turn. Not sorry. At last, but and last but not least, is there any chance in the name of higher power we could please get that plasma code recorded out of? Plasma code record. I cannot talk. <laughs> Out of the jukebox, please. Other than that, pretty smooth night. Have fun, Jack. Uh, let's do the jukebox, I think. I can still have little circles around you. Especially if uh, Starfish keeps hurting herself. <laughs> I'm the only other bar bartender, you dullard, and no wage doesn't cover cleaning shitty toilets. We chose the jukebox over pretzels. Of course, if that was like the mindset, then we'd probably never get anything done anywhere. Uh, press to change the program. Plasma codes love claw. Oh my gosh. Uh, will it tell me what I gotta do? Uh, gosh, my throat is all tickly. A lot of reading tonight, I guess. Uh, oh, I have to figure out how to light all this. Oh, shoot. Uh, 11, 13. Or I don't. Oh, I need to match that. Oh, wow. I just under, I, I understand the assignment now. Under stood. 17. That's 18. Okay, wait. How do I get 17 if that's the only option? I am confusion. Okay, well, I guess we'll do a different one. Oh. Does it change based on. No. And how do I do this one? Okay. This is the one, the only one we can do. Uh, can't do nine, ten. We can't do this one either. I'm so confused. Sixteen. Uh, 
but it's 17. Or it's, or you're saying it's 16? Five, 10, oh yeah. Five, 10, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Wait, if it's 16, then why didn't 16 work? I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> this puzzle is beyond me. Um, <coughs> press one, then 16. I can't press one, though. What about two and then 15? Though. I don't think they work on the same pages. Like, I think you've gotta pick it on the same pages. Ah, shoot. I did that wrong again. Oh, shoot. That's not what I wanted to do either. Ah! <laughs> Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, six, three. Did I do it? Was that what I had to do this whole time? Well, I feel stupid. <laughs> we tried though, so I guess that's something. Oof, mom called when I had phone stream into my TV. Talk about death. Oh my gosh. That's unfortunate. I could swear I was being closely watched. Oh, she's doing something. Maybe. Or is that just the game sound? Oh no, Mochi's that. passed out back there. Caleb, hello, welcome in. How are you doing, my friend? How was your weekend? Did you do anything fun? Oh, she straight up passed out. I thought the game sounds <laughs> were never getting into crap. He's, he's out. He didn't even hear me say his name. Why did they leave? What did they leave on the table? Is that jellyfish? Owls back from extinction. Jellyfish in a bottle. Ectoplasm. Maybe the Mothman will pay us a visit tonight. There's a place for everyone in Oriole City. I have no idea what's going on in this game. <laughs> Especially with Drake. Drake seemed a little more straightforward other than memory loss. Drake is like experiencing the weirdest, the weirdest crap that I, like, I don't, I don't know what's happening. Random things are appearing creepy as heck. Time for a break and some fresh air. All these spooky episodes are putting me on edge. I had a very interesting day, but my weekend was good. Went Halloween shopping. What kind of Halloween shopping were you doing? Like decorations or costumes or tell me more. I am going to be Barbie for Halloween. I don't even know if I have any Halloween things to go to, but it has to happen. We are going to just have a bunch of Barbie cosplays, because why not? Hydrate! Oh, I got you. Cheers, Lulu. I should make some tea. Uh, group effort. Yeah, there we go. Now, I'm about to paint Nessa's nails, so I'll just watch you on the phone for now. Okay, no worries, Lulu. Enjoy nail painting. That sounds fun. Tell Nessa hello for me. I had a very interesting day, but my weekend was good. But oh, we just, I read that. Wow, my brain. Yes, tell me more about Halloween shopping. Zoltar, hello, welcome in. Your color was the same color as Caleb, and I was like, I thought they were like combined messages. Hello, it's good to see you. It's been a while. How are you doing? How's, how's life? Yeah, there's no tea redeem, so you get to hydrate. Yeah, I don't have the tea on right now. I'd have to like go downstairs and get a mug and heat the water up and I do have the kettle and the tea all back there. I just, and it's even got water in it. I just don't have a mug right now. Decorations, of course. Went to like seven different spots. Didn't buy anything yet because I gotta be smart about the money, but I got two fall candles. Ooh, that's fun. 
are you like making plans then? Do you go all out like outside or inside your house for uh, Halloween things? I tend, I, I personally don't typically decorate for like holiday things very much. I kind of find it exhausting to like, <laughs> this is terrible, but to like put things up just to take them down after a month or so. So I tend to like just leave and go do experiential things. <laughs> but I do love more than anything is just reading by a lit Christmas tree. Like that's the best thing ever. Get some cocoa or some hot tea and you just curl up with cozy blankie. Read with just those lights on. Thanks for shouting out Ash. I appreciate it. She's streaming right now. Just chatting. Yeah, she's streaming right now. Uh, I do, lol. Outside, I go all out. Oh, that's awesome. Do you have like past pictures you could show me? Like you could share a Discord? Not, don't let it dox you. Like no house numbers or anything like that, but I'd love to see anything you've done before. So ready to decorate for fall? Convince Charlie to let me. Listen, you just, you just tell Charlie that I said it's time to decorate. It is time. We are in August. We waited so many long months. It's August, September, October. You need solid fall decoration. You could even leave it up in November if you don't like decorate for like Thanksgiving things. But you need like four months a year to have, have fall decorations up is not unreasonable. And then you could have Christmas stuff up like and winter stuff up. If it was just winter, you could have that up like December through February and that's like, so good. So, Charlie, that one's for you. <laughs> uh, whatever I see and like I get and fit wherever I can. Oh yeah, for sure, yes. My prop is spending too much. Oh my gosh, it's hard not to spend. I just realized I'm clicked out of the game, there's no sound. Although it's like dishes sounds if I did, but. Um, the, oh yeah, Thanksgiving, is, I read your message code, so I was like, Thanksgiving is in October. I was like trying to process that in my brain. For Canadians. Not for the USians. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's hard not to spend too much on hobbies. Like, if you enjoy it, like, I mean, I, I spend a small fortune on streaming, for sure. It's an expensive hobby, but uh, that's kind of the way it goes. But it's fun. And you can reuse the stuff the next year, right? So, investment. I guess it's still summer. Listen, Shadow, you're not helping my argument. That's rude. Well, Canadian Thanksgiving is in October. Our Thanksgiving is in November. September 1st is still summer. Oh my gosh, y'all are the worst. Just let a girl decorate for the fall, okay? Don't don't be don't be stealing any joy out here. There's no reason. I only decorate in October and December, so I do it right. For sure, my stash is a Halloween decoration to fill a room. I love that. Yes, exactly, Lulu. Don't be stealing any joy around here. Fellas, we love you, but let us decorate. <laughs> I'm saying decorate when you want, but Shadow's logic doesn't work. Okay, fair enough. I, I'll take that. I'll take that, goats. That's appreciated. <coughs> I actually might have to make some tea. My throat is not happy. Caleb! Oh my gosh, thank you for subscribing for 10 months! That's like crazy! 10 months of support. Thank you so much, my friend. I appreciate you very much. Enjoy your ad free viewing and your cutie little emotes. I have some emotes in progress and I need to work on them. It is on my to-do list. I officially wrote it in. I have like one or two emotes that are like ready to go. Sleeky, you have my permission to decorate, whatever. Thank you very much. I will not decorate at all. <laughs> I think, I think I would enjoy it. Like I used to love decorating my spaces when I was like in college and stuff. Um, but I think like, because it's just me, like, it's been a long time since I've had friends over for, like, holidays. I used to decorate when I was in Ohio because I had some, like, in-person friends there. And that was, like, a big deal. But I used to go help them, like, decorate their house. And so it was, like, blasphemy if I didn't decorate. But, like, the last four years or whatever, probably three or four Christmases especially, it's been, like, Nobody sees it except for me. There's literally no one over. I go to my parents' house for most of the holiday, so I'm like, why would I make, why would I decorate anything? It's just a bunch of time when I'm not home. <laughs> but I do I do enjoy like the vibes of decorating. Like I appreciate when other people decorate, and I think if I wasn't living alone, then I would decorate. Like that would be like, 
I don't know. Because it's not as much for me. It's, like, for other people. Like, I'd love to make that space for other people, but not not just for myself, typically. So I do, like, the bare minimum of just, like, a Christmas tree. Sometimes I decorate it. Sometimes I just let the Christmas tree be it. And sometimes I'll put up, like, other little things that are quick, but I won't put, like, hours into decorating for Christmas, at least. I do have some fall things. My sister has slowly been giving me, like, pumpkin, like, fabric pumpkins and, like, different uh, leaf-like things to stick everywhere. And so I do enjoy putting those out, but it's simple. So this year I will be going back to Ohio for October to see some of my friends from there. I'm really excited because I haven't seen them. This will be... we. Go, I've been visiting, like, every other October. So it's been two years essentially since I've seen them and that was when Trisha got married so I am excited to go see them again it will be wonderful we're gonna eat uh sushi sweet potato has anybody ever had sweet potato sushi sushi I don't know why I just said that sushi um have you all had sweet potato sushi reaper 17 months wait didn't you just subscribe or does it just feel like you just subscribed but thank you so much for 17 months holy heck that's a lot of support thank you very much Thank you, thank you, thank you. And for all the bits. I feel like I should say thank you every stream for the last, like, two weeks of bits or whatever it's been. <laughs> but thank you for all the things. But has anybody had sweet potato sushi? Like, the vegetarian style sweet potato sushi because it is so good. It's like, but you have to get, like, it's, like, fried or something like that. So, I mean, it's not that healthy, but it's, one place I had it was phenomenal. And I'm afraid to try it anywhere else. I also just subbed, but it runs out, like, three days later. Okay, that's fair. Because we did, like, because I took some time off from streaming to work for all the stupid work over the summer. So it probably was, like, everybody got the renewal, and then now we're re doing it again. But thank you. Thank you, both Caleb and Reaper. Getting us almost to a hype train. Getting getting that support in. I appreciate the heck out of y'all. Um, I'm pretty sure I was telling another story, and I've already forgot it. So we're going to go back to the game. <laughs> Uh, but tell me how sushi. Tell me, tell me if you like sushi. That's what I like to get with my friends uh, in Ohio and my friends here, really. Okay, what's with all these new pictures on the wall? Ooh, they're creepy. Gotta check with Jack about this. Never took him for a fan of German fairy tales. Mine hit just hit yesterday for a resub. Ooh, nice. Good timing then. Oh, I was gonna go. I think I'm gonna make tea. I'm gonna give you guys some BRB clips just so I can run downstairs and get a mug and I'm gonna go ahead and heat the water up. So I will be, I'll be right back. I'll turn on the music um, and do the clips. So let me, let me just switch that. Oh, uh, switch case. BRB, don't forget to clip. Thanks, bye. That's, that's the title. <laughs> that, that's, that's it, that's, that's all there is. Um, we're gonna play Dagon, which is by an HP Lovecraft. <laughs> Who got me? That was shit. <laughs> oh, I was not ready for that. <laughs> um, you guys don't even have music on this screen, do you? Game, I believe. Um, <laughs> just realizing there's no music, uh, link here. <laughs> set my heart for just a second. All right. Boo! I have not realized this for so long. Okay, let me, let me switch screens real fast so I can... Copy the sound thing. Oh, that's unfortunate. Real sorry about that. At least I figured it out eventually, right? That's something. If I could even find where I put it. Oh my gosh, I really need to organize my OBS. That's also on my to-do list, but I can only do it if I'm sitting here at my PC. I can't do it on my laptop. Welcome back. This is a weird BRB. Y'all suck. <laughs> I know it's weird. Uh, yeah, real quick one, but I'll, I'll go right back to it. I didn't go anywhere. I just have to find... Oh, there it is. The video source. Okay, I'm gonna switch. And now we should have... That's... That's... That's...
What the actual heck just happened? Oh my gosh. Well, I got it restarted. Hopefully y'all are still here. <laughs> I tried, but okay. You should have music now. It's probably extremely loud over the... No, you shouldn't have music now. Oh my gosh, I lost the ability to... Mm. This is terrible. This is terrible. This is... Everything is bad. Everything is not awesome. Oh my gosh, now you should have browser music. <gasps> Don't clip that! Shadow! That's not the thing to clip! Shadow! <laughs> please! Shadow, please! <laughs> You're only a pro streamer if you have issues. Listen. Listen. It would not be a sleeky stream. It would not be a sleeky stream without technical difficulties. We know this. Okay, I'm going to go get some tea now. I'll be back. To find my master as you are. Wait, okay. I don't want to curse him. Is that the option? Oh, is that the only I'm option? I'm gonna do it. <gasps> <gasps> Help! Help! <laughs> no! What is happening? What is happening? Ah! 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 No! I won't. Well, no, you don't jump off. Well, I did. That's well, how I died last your, time. With your. Uh... No! 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 <laughs> oh, you got, oh, you got your glider. Okay, everything's fine. Everything's fine. You fly with an umbrella? <laughs> yeah, I'm okay. I, the scariness. Oh, lag. Yeah, things and stuff. Hey, Burb, can you take hey, care don't, of that? Hey, don't, one? don't, don't, don't. Oh. Uh, don't. No, don't. <gasps> I was going to say, don't hit that. <laughs> I was about to say, don't hit that! I knew I'm so I was sorry. taking damage. It's okay. I knew I was taking damage from the falling sand. I just couldn't figure oh, out no. why it was swinging that way. Oh, it's okay. I'll oh. come back. Fuck off, please. I'm so dead because I can't fucking try it. Oh. Whoa! Oh, what is this? Whoa! 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 Don't make you start. Oh my god, there are people everywhere! Alice, hello! This laugh is like coming from everywhere. Oh! Oh, T! Oh! I just died. <laughs> I just died a little bit. Hi, T. Thanks for the bits. No thanks for the scare. But hi. Somebody clip that, please, somebody clip that. Please, please, please. That was a chaos. I don't know if this is working, but I wanna do my popper and it won't pop, and it's popping without popping, and nothing's happening. <laughs> I'm upset. Nothing is working. Get down, Mochi. Yeah. What is oh, happening? Hi, Raiders. Hi, hi. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, nothing's happening. I gotta get another one. I'll be back. I can't hear yours. Hi, 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 hi. 
Oh, you're in the art. <laughs> that one's on TikTok too. So if you go check out my TikTok, then yeah, that too. This was almost, guys. This was almost tragic. I got my mug. It came up, and my water was almost heated, and I was out of honey. But I fortunately had backup honey downstairs, so we're fine. I want a droopy hat. I'm just gonna pick my own. Or shall I just do like a. I'll do one of my chocolate teas. I don't even know if you guys can hear me. Remember that one time when I got the uh, Kid Possible cosplay stuff and then I still haven't done it? Yeah, me, me too. <laughs> Let's move back, 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 back again. again. Again, dead love friend. Snapple! Oh my gosh, thank you for 100 biddies. Happy Monday to you too. Nice to see your face as well. I'm so glad you're here. I'm so glad you're here. You remember that it was glorious? Remember when I never actually did the cosplay on stream after that? Listen, Kim Possible shows her belly, and I am very self conscious. I have like. Listen, real talk. Real talk, real talk. Since I moved from Ohio. I gained a lot of weight because very, very poor mental health. And it's taken a heck of a long time to get it back off. And not that I'm doing, I left my tea over there. Gosh dang it. And I put my headphones in, oh my gosh. <laughs> today, today was the perfect day for, oh fox sake, mug. It was, it just, I just spilt that everywhere. You know, some days you just can't win. Just skinny AF, I'm really not. I'm really not. This is a super oversized shirt for one thing, so it's definitely gonna look worse than it is, but, uh, but I'm definitely not skinny. <laughs> a dope cup, right? I love it, I love it so much. You really are, but okay. No, I really am not, actually. I used to be like, 25 pounds lighter was like my standard. And I just don't feel comfortable as comfortable in my body. Like I'm more comfortable in my body in different ways. Like since like in the past year, you guys have seen this transformation. In the past year, I became a lot more comfortable in myself and like knowing who I am. And like some of that fixing the mental health things, going through therapy, getting on the medication, like that has helped a lot. Just like I haven't been able to prior prioritize like working out and like eating better because I was focusing so hard over the last year on just like surviving. Like I was just straight up in survival mode. You guys know this, you've heard all the spiels, but uh, so like now that I'm like starting to get stabilized on things, I'm like trying to get things in a better realm where I can like start going at least back on walks again because that really helps a lot if I can't go to the gym. I really want to take some dance classes again if I can. Um, and like starting to eat better and stuff. But it's just, it's a journey. It's a journey. So it's going to take some time. I'm learning to love myself as I am. And that's that's just the way it's going to be. As you get older, metabolism goes crazy too. So it's just, it is what it is. How's the music volume compared to my voice? I feel like I'm yelling a bit. That could just be a mayor. Also, oh my gosh. I brought a lint thing and it's laying back here again. Of all the days, of all the days that I chose to wear my old earbuds instead of wearing my headset where I could just get up and not have to take them out of my ears every five seconds, like that's, that's, that's the day. I think you're cute for what it's worth. Thank you, ghost. That's very sweet. The pleasure of talking to you every morning, Danielle, I for sure know. Oh, for sure. You just always go with your usernames. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I just, I'm just so used to calling Danielle Danielle at this point. You're actually one of the most beautiful women streamers I've personally seen. One of the reasons that got me the first volume. Oh my gosh. That's awkward. I prob I swear, I'm not fishing for compliments. You guys don't have to, like, don't <laughs> give me compliments. I will be uncomfortable, but. I just was just like being real with y'all like mental health is so much more than 
than just mental things. And I just have a lot of work to do. And that's okay, because I'll do it. Also these, for y'all that have pets, these are like a dollar at the dollar store. Dollar 25 now or whatever. But uh, get one, because you don't have to have all the sticky sheets. It doesn't have to be as annoying. They're not like incredible, but they do help a lot. And I remembered I had one, I was like, oh, I'm gonna grab that while I'm getting a bug. Cool. So if you have to do it the right direction or you add hair, I, sometimes I can't tell which direction I'm supposed to be going. Oh no. That's just my opinion, but I do understand. I, I do appreciate, I do appreciate y'all um, being honest with me and such, because it does, it does help. Like, self-esteem is low, and I'm aware of that. I'm working on it. So, I appreciate it. I do appreciate it. Uh, so I did goats, I like it that way. Uh, Daniel asked me to call her Danielle. Yeah. I know you're not after a couple of it. I just thought it would be nice to share. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Sorry, I don't mean to be, like, rude about it. I, you got... I, I'm bad at taking compliments for one, but I just wanted to make sure everybody knew I wasn't just saying that, but... But yeah, so all that to say, I haven't done the Kim Possible cosplay yet because I didn't return the pants on time. And so I needed a larger size, technically. But I just need to do it. I just need to get a plan, so... That's, that's, that's what we're up to right now. I just need to plan it out better. And so I may wait until closer to October because I'm hoping that we can do Frank and Drake um, and then I have one more that I want to show off and then do The Last of Us and then maybe right after that we can jump into that do a cosplay and maybe like a some sort of fun stream thing 2kp cosplays no 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 just like one just like well I guess I could wear it for one of our Halloween cosplays again. This is gonna be the first like legit cosplay other than, well, no, this is the second, other than um, Little Nightmares. That was that was definitely the first one. What did I just do? Lights flicker. Ooh, I'm gonna break everything. Oh my gosh. Oh, we got a free one before? Yeah, but that was just like trying things on. It wasn't like full out. I didn't do makeup or anything like that, so. Also, I didn't think to get a spoon. This is just a mess. This, see, this is why sometimes I just can't handle doing tea because there's so many things to remember and I just leave things sitting in so many places. That's fine. It's fine. You did Hermione too and Audrey Hepburn. Yeah, I mean, I did those, but they were like cosplays. It was like me dressing as those characters. Could have fooled me, Ayo. Listen. Listen, it definitely wasn't, it wasn't the thing, but it was fun. I think I highlighted it because I sent it to somebody or something, so it's probably, the preview's probably still on my profile. Oh, Alice, yeah, you're okay. You're okay. There's still some people that call uh, Danielle Hulk lover, even though she's like, even when she tells him, usually it doesn't seem like Danielle cares too much. Danielle can speak for herself, obviously. But usually she just like reminds people that you can call her Danielle as well. Just no hard feelings. No hard feelings. I'm using uh, the end of a used fork for my tea, so no judgment. But I did make, I did get chocolate tea. So I'm really excited about that. I will use random names for you. Oh my gosh. Reaper's just out here to make it worse. Is that honey? This? Yes. Honey. Forty. Yeah, forty. It's a product of USA, Canada, Argentina, and Mexico. Honey should not be fed to infants under one year of age. It is a true source certified. Oh my gosh, thank you for three months. Thank you so much for the support and using your Prime sub. You can only use that one place a month. Thank you so much for using it on me. I appreciate you and I'm really glad you're part of this community, truly. Truly, truly. I don't mind, just don't call me late for supper. Never, but never. Bloodlust, hi, how are you? It's so good to see you. How are you, my friend? I feel like I've seen you so much in passing and not actually gotten to talk to you very much. 
but I'm glad to see you, all that to say. How was your weekend? I don't think we talked about, we haven't talked about your weekend yet. How was your weekend? Just got home from work and guess what? Having more fries with paper mayo. I love that you've been converted to mayo with fries. That makes me so happy. One by one, I'm gonna get you all to eat mayo on your fries because it is just the thing to do. But let's see, oops, I didn't mean the why, but it works, it does. <laughs> it does work. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry, I'm very uh, much coughing tonight. I'm not sure what's going on. So if you eat fries with no condiments, that's allowed. You just saw Mix It Up Bot is a bit slow, clips. Oh, going into Discord? It's probably from the stream um, glitch that happened. It's my pleasure. You're wonderful. You're so kind, Snapple. You're so sweet. I appreciate it. Discord, yeah. It just Sometimes it just takes a bit to get into Discord. Because it's like, gotta convert it. Like, once it's processed in Twitch, and then it'll drop it into Discord. It's cool. Alright. I don't know what this is doing, but it just feels like a weird shape. I don't like it. Whatever. The most dumbfounded moment at work tonight I have to share? Please do. Please do share. And at the same time, I'm gonna switch to the game so we can continue. And talk at the same time. This way. <laughs> oh, I do need to pause the music, though. Alright. 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 Now I feel like I gotta be so quiet. Uh, okay. The similarities between this and the myth of Persephone always fascinated me. The absent father, Whee! the mother's inability to protect her children, being swallowed up by darkness, and then rebirth. We. Okay, do you guys hear the dishes sounds? I keep thinking that's in my house. Like, that that is mochi. Who's no longer there. Which makes me nervous. <laughs> Was this that quiet? I mean, it's always been quiet for me, but I don't know if it's quiet for y'all. I need to figure out the balance of those, too. AJ Guy Slayer, welcome to the Discord. Are you here? You don't have to say anything. But is that somebody I know? <laughs> uh, so this kid, I don't want to say that he's dumb, but... He because that is mean, but my god, I have not met a dumb person like this before. Anyways, he asked if he just throws away the ketchup bottles that we use in the kitchen on a daily basis. Oh no. Oh no. That's a nah. Hey mods. These sounds are getting to me. Mods, make sure you just keep an eye on Discord if you would. That may be somebody we know, but... Oh, it's you! Okay, okay, we're good, we're good, good, we're good. It's Snapple. Whew. Okay, thank you. I, it, I, it didn't say Snapple, and so I was nervous. Thank you. Thank you for clarifying. I just gotta be careful, you know? You know? Appreciate it. Thanks for joining. We literally fill them and use them daily, and he's worked there for the last year, so he still asks. Maybe it bothers him that they get refilled and not just like repurchased when grateful death promises a young man he'll send him messengers beforehand to warn him about his end but the poor sad poor sod can't take a hint typical i like this image it speaks a lot i mean it's fast food fair you don't have to watch travel i was just i was just confused oh wait was i supposed to do something with this oh no it changed a little break from death to cheat the devil. Thank you. What's happening? Heavy duty plastic that we refill? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We did that when I worked at a, a pizza place. We had other things other than pizza, so we had ketchup too. We had to refill them all the time. Uh, taking life from the animals to give it to humans. Who thought that was a good idea? Someone's obsessed with death and mortality. Jack doesn't strike me as the kind of person who carries such ex existential thoughts, but who knows? I've seen more remarkable things, especially tonight. Ketchup pizza, Sleeky's favorite? No, I do not like ketchup. You know I do not like ketchup. Blech. Ugh. 
No, thank you. I definitely eat mayo on pizza before I eat ketchup on pizza, which is very contradictory, but it's still a thing for me. Painted by two letters of the alphabet, D, B. Uh, was this person so lazy, so busy, or has a name so long that they can't be bothered to write it out, at least one of the names? Or perhaps they're just hiding their identity. That's always a possibility, I guess. Strange bribes from the lady, though. I'm not sticking around. Looks like she could open her eyes at any minute. It's creepy. I'll take all your ketchup. You're welcome to it. Why that? Oh, her eyes did. I, I told you her eyes could open at any minute, and they straight up did. Creepy as heck. I almost missed it too. Let's play harmonica. Oh, I'm here for this. This is good. Ketchup and pizza sauce are pretty much the same thing. That's why I said it's contradictory, but still. Who's there? I hear you. Come out. I think the drugs have fried his brain. Yes, confirm he uses drugs. That, I mean, that probably does have a lot to do with it then. There's no one here. That goddamn orange smoke is ruining my evening. Need to sleep it off. But before, a quick stop for a little chat with her. With who? Ketchup is just a vessel for sugar. Yes. And I did finally try Duke's mayo that's like the no sugar added mayo. And it is so good. I would definitely... I, I don't notice like a huge difference between it and Hellman's. But I definitely liked it. And like the more vinegary taste of it. So I'm definitely switching to Duke's. What are we doing? I don't know what we're doing at this moment. We're just going inside. Oh, oh, Pearl Lambert. Was that her mom? Oh, it's my, oh, no, it, hit, it, it hits a little too real now. It's our animal. Little Lawrence Wingy. You're in real danger, the threat that looms over you. Who, why? Overheard in the old chestnut. There is no meaning of life. You don't say. Wearing socks to bed is a good idea. Why? It's okay to fart in front of your significant other. No comment. <laughs> Bits and parts of soul. It is a curious thing, the death of a loved one. It is like walking up the stairs to your bedroom in the dark, and thinking there is one more stair than there is. Your foot falls down through the air, and there is a sickly moment of dark surprises as you try and readjust the way you thought of things. Let me snick it, horseradish. I like that. I've already read that, no. All right, let's do the journaling. Conversations with mother, part one. Badger hates society and invitations and dinner and all that sort of thing. The rat, W-I-T-W. I must not complain. I must accept the Spartan conditions of my new shabby apartment. The acrid wafts of a dying dog and an ominous presence who seems to have the constitution of an ox and the liveliness of a two-toed sloth. What a strange heartbeat. But that's okay. I'm fine. No, I'm not fine. I flat out hit rock bottom. How did I get here? What have I done with my life, mother? I hope you realize, wherever you are, that you should have shared more with your son about who and what he really is. Raising me in that bubble of hermetic home life did me no favors. Look at me now, a grown-up, depending on the kindness of a stranger who claims to be a friend of yours. I thank you, but I also blame you. Still, you're the only one I could share my life with, so I guess you're stuck with me even in the afterlife. You can't exactly complain about not having time now. I'll be sharing the apartment with the very unpleasant superintendent, Frank, and his dying dog who seems to categorically dislike me. I don't blame him, though, as it was also confirmed that he won't be seeing each other. So all's well that ends well, I guess. I spent the minimum time needed to unpack and went straight to the bar. But in between, something strange happened. There was this orange smoke coming from Frank's room, and a sudden burst of energy entered my organism and seemed to lock into my brain, like a powerful drug. And that's when everything changed. At first, some of the apartment objects started moving on their own, as if some sprightly specter was practicing their antics. But it only got stranger, and this, my dear mother, affects you directly. While walking to work, I came upon these familiar hobo symbols on a wall. Remember our game? And from there, an entity came out and talked to me directly. 
It was a hobo by the name of Little Lawrence Wingy, who spoke as if they were delivering a message from you to warn me that there's some, some unsavory character after me, and I'm in real danger. I really must ask Frank what kind of stuff he's into and if he can do it outside the house. I don't want any more eerie dead hobos appearing to me in the middle of the night. It was a trying night. I was at the bar taking care of a jammed jukebox when I felt an offbeat presence that chilled me to the bone, which is a bit odd since I can't perceive changes in temperature, remember? I felt it inside the bar and while looking at one of the paintings that miraculously appeared on the hall to the back exit. Outside, while taking a break, I felt another presence, but it had different vibrations, so it was probably just a drunk customer pissing in the woods. I think I need my fix ASAP. I'm doing it tomorrow. I really must go now. The sun will come out any time now. Heading home? Home? Yes. I guess it will be for a while. Good night, mother. Don't let the worms bite. Was there something I could... Oh, yeah. Hi, Frank. Okay. And I must ask Frank what kind of stuff he's into. He can do it outside. And plus, it's a paternity. Don't blame him. Let's try that one. We'll send that note to Frank. Something about that. I don't know what it is, but something about that. Y'all, I want to draw like this so badly. Wait, is this the mother? Wait, what? Oh, that would be messed up. Mom? Oh, that would mess you up. No thanks. Never seen this game before? So it came out in June, very end of J June. Very end of June. Um, it's an indie game, so it's not like super, super largely known, but it was, it did go pretty well at release. So you might've seen it. I, I might've shared about it before too. So you might've seen it. Um, I might have shared some of the, their, like, development posts on Twitter and such. The, uh, developer and publisher shared my Twitter post about it today, which was so sweet. That doesn't happen often, and it always means so much when it does happen. But it, it does frequently happen, like, with indie publishers and stuff, because they're, like, fully, like, heart is fully into the game. That's why I love indie developers so much. What's that? Hey there, baby face. Remember me? Not yet, huh? I don't want to pressure you, but we have unfinished business to attend to, and I really need your help. Remember this? I love you more than soft cinnamon pretzels. Whoa. What are you guys thinking about this game so far? I'm curious, like, what your thoughts are on the style and gameplay and such. Because I know you guys aren't, like, directly playing it, but what do you think of the story? Buddy, that orange gas damaged you real good. Hope it's not permanent. Who's trying to hurt you, and why do you feel like you know that woman in the mirror? Anyway, you haven't got time to dwell on that, because you've got stuff to do. You've got stuff to do. Story of my life. Oh, f flicker, flicker? Now that it's just gone? Oh no, it's still there. Just not in that same form. Beanies make my forehead itch so bad. <laughs> I, like, unknowingly will just scratch my forehead all the time. New note. Hi, Frank. What on earth was, earth was that orange smoke? If that's a habit of yours, I want you to know that it had a harrowing effect on me all night. To the point I thought I was losing my mind. And I hope it doesn't, it didn't hurt that feeble dog of yours. Does Ham know about your habits? Having fun with this? I am. I am. I'm enjoying it. A lot. I love the art style. Oh, our relationship is getting worse and worse. It is now non-existent. Oof. Harsh. Little does Drake know that you were as victim of the evil device as him. A bit arrogant of him to suggest that Ham is not aware of such bad behavior from you. At least from that rude introduction, we know it affected him as well. You will have to give him some explanation about what happened last night. Tell the truth or lie. Imagination is the only weapon in the war with reality. 
I think I sweat too much for a beanie. Plus, it messes up my hair up. I mean, fair. I've had my hair down for a couple days, so. The cat's name is Ham? Is that what it is? Because we've talked about Ham a lot. Oh, calendar. I was like, what's wiggly now? Check out Sophia and Jerry. Take rent collection to Ham. Oh, well, we have to choose. Ooh, uh. Taking the rent collection makes more sense to me. It showed a picture of a cat? Oh, I missed it. Well, I guess we're gonna meet Ham in a second. Or maybe not. Take rent collection to Ham. Thursday. Nothing. Woke up with a splitting headache. Uh. More notes. He's back there. It's like much disappeared. Tell Drake about the orange smoke device. Wait, is that it? <laughs> okay. Easy. Easy enough. Okay. Uh, we read that. Anything else for the diary? No. So... We're good, right? We chose Ham's center. Instead of Sophia's apartment. Look at the puppy. Underdog is so cute. Sweet puppers. How do we, how, how did, how did Drake know that the dog is dying? Did they just assume? I feel confused. All right, anyway, let's go to Ham's, Ham's place. What's that? What? Heartbeat? What? Mmm. The heck? This nest is made out of all kinds of things. What the heck is this? That seems super sketch. But it's the pistachios are there too. The pistachio shells. So maybe it has something to do with the person that was clogging up the drain pipe. Interesting. Estamos aquí. I like that he has uh, two bolts on his necklace. Yes, there's something fishy about that van. Anyway, there's always something fishy about white and black vans with no logos and tinted windows and parked in the middle of nowhere. This is so trippy. Who drugged us? And like, why did it have such a wild effect? Estamos aquí. We are here? Is that what it is? Is that the translation? I'm so rusty on my Spanish. Estamos aquí. Estamos aquí. We're here. Yes. Ha. Yes. Translated it properly. Happiness. Weird place to put it. Coat. Pro streaming. Nah, I has nothing to do with streaming. Whoa. What just happened? I am confused. Common dreams, do they have deeper meaning? Oh yeah, we read that. Whoa! Being chased. I didn't know that I was like selecting a thing. Falling. Oh no, it only lets me choose being chased. Okay, okay. Guess we're, oh. Quiet, please. Lou, get in session. Okay, do we go to the yoga door? Or do we go to the dream interpreter?
Back of my head says Doro88, and I still don't know what that means. We're going to the Dream Reader, because why not? Oh, I guess I can't. I can only just look at it. I know, I've been trying to figure out what it said for so long. That's the first time I've like fully been able to see it. Oh, yoga is in session. Quiet, please. It's a very interesting symbol that popped up. Oh, I can go to like one door at a time is what's happening. Yoga poses. Oh, that one moved. You know him, trust you. And you can get you can go to her office when she's absent. But don't go around. Groceries are put away. I got you some snacks. What did you get, industry? Oh my gosh, please tell me more. I heard snacks. I am here. I am present. I need to eat. I'm really bad about eating dinner on streaming nights. Ham's holistic home. In we go. Wheat thins and baby carrots? Let's go. I do, I, I do like wheat thins. Cheese and crackers, good. Uh, baby carrots with ranch, also good. Or like uh, sour cream and onion dip. Why no food? Listen, I just honestly didn't think about it. I didn't feel hungry, therefore here we are. I didn't eat dinner last night either. That's becoming a bad habit. I'm gonna fix that. I need to get groceries. I'll order groceries for pickup tomorrow. That's what we shall do. I could type a note. Literally anything. Hi. Ham. Sorry. Oh no. How do I go back? I don't remember how to go back. Oh no! I can't go back. Whatever. That. I missed you. Why are you apologizing to Ham? You guys eat every day? Every day? You guys don't eat every day? Aren't you supposed to eat three times a day at least? Like every three or four hours is like... Goals. Biggest meal being breakfast. Small meals for the rest. You eat more than three? Then why'd you- why'd you say- why'd you say up up up? <laughs> Strange. Nothing. What's happening? Whoa. Four ten six 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 one six two zero. Backing you for not eating. Oh, it's not to industries. Industry, you only eat twice a day. I mean, that's basically what I've been doing. My medication makes it harder for me to eat. I think, like, to feel hungry, and I don't have like. I don't have like the most obvious food right now, if that makes sense, to like entice me to eat, so. I just keep forgetting. I eat when I'm at work, but I haven't been eating very much. Saturday, go to the farmer's market, check on Tori, buy some Palo Santo and White Sage, organize next week. I don't remember what day it is. Friday, yoga session, usual time, deposit tenants rent, copy therapy. Most people skip breakfast. It's not like that's the meal that you really shouldn't skip. I'm not very good at getting like enough food for breakfast, but I try to do protein. Can't skip breakfast. Breakfast is always the first meal you eat because you are breaking your fast. Also very true, very true. I have to eat in the morning. I have to have some protein with my meds. Otherwise I get kind of sick. Key. I wanted that to make more noise. I just starve in the morning and I like it. Hmm. 
Welcome back, Lulu. Back again. Her nails are done. Kids in bed now. Silence. Nice. Very nice. Uh, I always get something for breakfast. May not be a lot, but always something. I usually, I always do a protein shake, and then I try to also get some, like, some sort of, like, protein bar or something when I'm at work. And if I can, I'll do, like, oatmeal or, I don't know, something else on the weekends. I try not to let coffee be the first thing I do after medicines, but sometimes it's just, that's the first thing I grab. <laughs> Ham hides the keys for each drawer in different places, so she doesn't seem to care for the safety of her client's information, but the building and personal info, on the other hand... Why am I going through files? Was this what I was supposed to be doing? I might just start doing protein shakes easy. It's just early. It is just easy is what I was trying to say. Um, it, it, it like I just get, uh, oh shoot, what do they call? I can never remember the name of them and I buy them regularly. I don't know. I get a protein shake and like I just order a bunch of them from like Sam's Club or I can get them at Walmart or whatever too. Um, Premier Protein, that's what they're called. I get Premier Protein shakes. That way I always have some protein in the morning before lunch. Because sometimes I'll go to lunch late too. And so that's a really long time. Like 1.30 to be eating lunch and not have had any breakfast. Especially if I skip dinner the night before. I'm never good about having two shakes a day. So that would be the solution. Uh, I usually eat around 1.30. That's what I tend to do. I've been doing better about earlier. Eating earlier too. Why am I... Why am I going through, I don't understand why I'm going through clients' things, but apparently I'm supposed to be. I feel uncomfortable. Time to eat, so back to lurking. Go look and say hi to them. Shout out to Ham. Yes, I shall. If we see Ham, I, I shall tell them hello. Are we marking this for ourselves? Oh. Hmm. I love the reading. Like when I'm reading them, I just feel very weird about reading the client's stuff. I guess I have to. They're not really giving me any options. I feel like I need to text you throughout the day just to tell you to eat. I know I'm getting, I'm working on it. We're like working specifically in therapy about eating more and better. I, I go through phases where I was like doing so much better with eating consistently and like small snacks and stuff throughout the day and then I started the new medication the stimulant and for ADHD and I just like have fallen off on my habit of doing more eating so and I haven't bought groceries and that's the biggest thing because I'm like I don't want to snack I don't want to eat fast food but like I am struggling to get the energy still to cook so we'll see with like my medication increase if that helps but that's really what I need to do so, sorry. Transfer of property ownership. To set phone alarms for food. Okay, see the thing is, I think about it and I know that I should eat, but I'm like, I'm not hungry and I don't have the energy to do anything about it. Ariel City, Hamilton Diaz. Okay. So it's not really that I like, I typically remember. It may not be at the most convenient time that I remember, but it's like, I go through this like setup where I either am going to eat what's convenient or I'm not going to eat. And I go through these phases where I wanna eat better. So then I will not get groceries because I'm overwhelmed with the idea of cooking and like just going back to that rhythm when I've been in depression mode for so long and just like not functioning so like I need to sit down and like meal plan like genuinely think about what I used to make what I want to eat and things like that and like just do it like start getting it there but I like cannot for some reason make myself do the grocery part and then when I finally give in and do groceries I just get whatever I have been eating so it's just a you know it's just a process realign chakras or realign healing crystals. I wanna do healing crystals. Understand some things take time and you figure it out. Yeah, 
Eventually, I'll get it there. Vacay at my place for a week. You'll eat. I like to cook. See, I do fine if someone cooks. And I do fine if I let myself eat out. And if I have, like, girl dinner, you know, like, snacks and stuff around the house, I do better. But it's just the in-between that I struggle with. Yeah, I would, I would definitely take food ideas. I, I, my plan is to go back through, because I love making, like, soups especially, and that's what I actually enjoy, like, the process of cooking, like, chopping all the vegetables and, like, getting it all ready. Um, so what I need to go do is, like, go back through those recipes and just buy the ingredients so that I'm like, oh, I want to make food, but I don't really know what to make. I, like, already have it there, if that makes sense. Set a foreman grill beside your bed. Set an alarm. Put on. Put some bacon on. Set another alarm. Then wake up to the smell of bacon. It's nutritious and good for you. Just don't burn your foot. Wait. Deja vu. Wait. Did you do that? You didn't do that. You didn't do that. Um. Ba Bacon's one of those things that I just stresses me out. I love bacon, but it uh. It it it. Uh, it's got to be really simple, Lulu. It's got to be really simple and fairly healthy. It's Michael Scott. Oh, <laughs> oh, that makes sense. That that adds up. That does add up. <laughs> um, but bacon, like the grease and all of that, like I just <laughs> these are just weird, stupid quirks that I just need to figure out in life. But I just instead I just avoid them. But like I never quite understand what I should do with like the grease because I know you're not supposed to put it down the sink. And like my mom always had like something separate that she could put it in. But like, then my brain is like, what do I do? Like, what if I don't have something separate? And what do I do with this if, if it still needs cleaned out? And so I just avoid, it's weird. It's, it's, it's fine. It's probably like an anxiety thing. Soups this month are gonna be pho, chicken pot pie, cheesy potato. Chicken pot pie would be good. I really like baking typically broth based soups so like I have a like lemon chicken and rice one that I really love um basin grease in a mason jar but what do you do do you just throw the mason jar away after it's full like what do you do with it from there isn't that a waste like I could just not eat bacon <laughs> you know like I just my brain just can't I just can't healing stones how do I know what to pick up? Oh, based on the numbers. Wait, can I not click on anything? What's, well, nothing's vibrating. I keep bacon grease in a Tupperware and stick them in the fridge to cook with later. That laugh though, did I make an, ex <laughs> an awkward laugh? So you don't deprive yourself of, I don't, I don't know what that word is. Grease in jars, what I do as well. What do you do with the jar of grease? What do, you, what do you do with it? <laughs> oh, bacon in Spanish. Tocino? Until it cools down, then toss it in the garbage. The whole mason jar? Listen, mason jars are precious. That's why I make my Javi coffee in. Exclamation point, Javi. <laughs> Shameless plug. No, the Greek. How do you. So you like fish it out? I haven't had pho before yet, Lulu. Basically broth and just add in toppings, kind of like ramen, it has rice noodles in it. I'd definitely try that. I would definitely try that. Mason jars, but I'm so, see this is, I just overthink it so bad. So like you fill, you let all the grease dry in a mason jar and then you just like spoon it out and throw it away and then clean the mason jar or just leave the mason jar and just keep filling it up is that all you have to do because if they do that then i can definitely do that pho pho you're right sorry i forget that every time when i'm reading it yeah 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 yeah. thank you for the reminder shadow also i still don't know what i'm doing oh never mind i know what i'm doing <laughs> oh wait maybe i don't know what i'm doing they don't all have numbers. Ah, oh, shoot. When it's full, take it out in the woods. Put it under a sterno in a burner to track bears during hunter season. 
first of all, I don't have woods near me. Well, I mean, I kind of do, but we don't have bears. And I don't know that I want to attract bears because I don't hunt. So, that's kind of a deer hunting thing around here. Never made it yet. Gonna test it probably this week. I'll let you know how it is. Yes. Not under the st On. What is a sterno? Shims are cool. I like it too. You asked what I did? Oh. In general, what are you supposed to do? <laughs> Y'all are not helpful. The anxiety is still very real. <laughs> you can use as lard fat replacement. Okay, so I don't have any recipes that I use lard and fat. Which I don't really have recipes to begin with. But I don't have recipes that take lard and fat. So what... I don't make biscuits. My brain is straight up glitched right now. You're so right, Jeno. I feel so dumb right now. Listen, cooking was never my thing. It was never my thing for holidays. I would choose to do like everything else to help. My sister was like the one that cooked. Burning grease is a great bear attract for hunting. We burn that in honey. Like Pooh Bear? Like, like honey, like Pooh Bear. Pie crust. I definitely don't make pies. If it involves baking, that's a no. I want to be, like, when I am cooking, I want to be fully immersed in the experience. Like, I don't want to put anything in the oven and wait. If it goes in the oven, it's a wait from my brain. So, candle. Do you make homemade candles with your grease? <coughs> But I've seen people dis when I've seen people disposing of grease, put aluminum foil in the sinkhole, like make it bowl shape, pour grease in it, let it cool, solidify, then wad it up and throw it away. Is that is throwing away aluminum foil better than throwing away like digging grease out of a mason jar? These are the real questions I have in my life that I don't ask until apparently this moment. I cook my green beans and bacon grease. Other than that, I don't use it. I guess I could do that, but I typically just do like the French cut green beans and I just give a little seasoning and roll with it. I was gonna tell you how I make bacon in the oven. Yeah, so you see, mm, I don't want to wait for it to continue. I don't wanna wait for a stove to heat up. I don't want to wait for the food to be in the stove. Snapple, you're doing such a good job of trying to get me to actually do this puzzle and I'm too, I'm so invested in this grease situation. I'm so sorry. Um, this is seven, six, nine. Uh, so I need nine to be here. I mean, if you're baking in a skillet, let it solidify, then scoop it in the trash. I mean, that's kind of what I do. I don't do bacon in a skillet either. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Kayla, did you just really give us some to bacon right now? Oh my god. Uh, you know, I'm gonna have to buy bacon just so I can figure out this grease situation now, right? Like, I, I avoid the grease situation so hard that I even buy like the hamburger and stuff that has the least amount of fat and grease so that I don't have to worry about it. Like I just don't. <laughs> I'm terrible you all. I, I have lived in a world of just completely avoiding situations instead of dealing with them. So you're welcome. All right, we got seven, eight, nine. This one's going to go here. So I should be able to rearrange this now. I'm assuming that's eight. I don't actually know, but. I know this is one. I feel like this is two. Mm, that's all I need to do. I'm gonna have to mix this one up too. Um, I'm gonna go with that being two. Or this is two, cause it faces that way. Hmm. 
Bacon has made me very happy in my life. At least I could do is give to the sub. <laughs> Caleb, oh my gosh. <laughs> See, I line my bacon sheet with aluminum. I lay my bacon out on it side by side and bake it at 425 until it looks good. Then I toss the foil plus keep the sheet clean. Okay, I could see the value of that. I have, uh, like, it's like a, probably a QVC thing, um, but it's like a, a brown container that has, like, a tray on it. So you put the bacon on it. It's, like, for one person. You put the bacon on it, and it's, like, a tray, and it will, like, catch the grease on the bottom, and then you put the lid on it, you put it in the microwave, and it has, like, a vent. And so you can just, like, microwave bacon to make it really crispy. And I like doing that, but I don't know what to do with the grease every time. I literally like just panic. So I just don't buy bacon anymore. Wait, how is this a puzzle? How's Crystal supposed to go? So I think I need to do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So, <laughs> listen, you can't all be hating on my bacon habits. It's like he just drinks the grease. No, I just panic. I usually get like a paper towel and I like wipe it out and throw it away and then just do my best to scrub it afterwards. But I don't do it often because it causes me anxiety. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Y'all listen, <laughs> I'm trying. I microwave bacon. I am the one that microwaves bacon, okay? Oh, hey, I did it. I love when I accidentally solve puzzles. It's like the best feeling. <laughs> it's like my subconscious just do what you do. Goats. I knew I liked you the best. Oh, do I get to do the chakras too? Or did I choose between these personal? I probably should have paid attention to what they were. Alley building? Oh, I think I did the wrong thing. I'm not, I don't want to read all that. Was there multiple files? Which one did I do? Oh, picture. Please come join us for our new book release. Yes, I would love to join you for a book release, please allow me to come. October 20th is a little far away, but I would love to come. Ambrosia Park. Happy days in Ambrosia Park mini break with Pearl Lambert and Sophia Mildred. So Pearl Lambert was the mom 1970. So it was 70, like past 70. Quits being a mod to microwave to a microwave baking cooker. Wait, what? I will encourage Sleeky to take care of herself in any way she can. See, Goats is my champion. How about pre-cooked bacon? That's okay to heat up in the microwave and no grease puddle. Oh my gosh. Listen, I'm just, I'm just out here. I, I already told you guys, I just don't make bacon. I just don't make bacon. When I go to Disney every other year-ish, I just eat all the bacon I can, <laughs> okay? That's that's what we do. <laughs> that's that's what we do. And occasionally I get a bacon cheeseburger at Wendy's, okay? That's the extent of bacon. I just don't do it because it causes me anxiety. It's just, it's just a quirk. You just have to accept it. <laughs> Make bacon, not war. Yes. Yes. But... I mean, ooh, if you want to come over and make me bacon or just like drop off bacon at any point, I will not be upset with that. Now that I read that one. Green. Let's close that. Or eat pre-cooked bacon cold. Boom. That's what my dad does, but I don't want to do that. It's like salty. Just It's just salty meat. Like there's other things that I could eat easily that I apparently don't even eat anyway. That van is definitely tailing me. I'm gonna tell Shads you microwave bacon. Please don't. Shads, Shads will champion me like goats. I'm pretty sure. Oh my God. Caleb. Why? If any of these people are like real accounts and show up, it's gonna be so embarrassing. Bacon cakes zero. Because. Are you just like supporting bacon since I don't? I love bacon. Bacon is my friend. Well, now we know what's wrong with goats. Well, goats can only, goats has a very like limited diet due to allergies, so. Just one of those things. My two have to at this point, leave the microwave bacon thing out so I can uh, borrow it and never give it back. <laughs> no, it's bacon pancakes. Bacon pancakes zero. What about banana pa- Oh, the game moved on without me. Shoot. 
Oh, this is awkward. But what about banana pancakes? That's a good song, you know? What have you done to my soul? I ate cold bacon once it's cooked, like, cold. I have an issue. Yes, goats gets a pass. I have been the worst about occasionally giving goats a hard time about food until I remember that goats has an allergy and I need to stop it. Love thy neighbor. Connection is real. I don't know what I'm supposed to be getting from that. What I'm what I'm supposed to be asking that. Make it pancakes, make it bake it pancakes. Week 52, Thursday. Let me take a sip before I do reading. It'll probably be like one paragraph after I do this preparation. Enhanced it, my dear. <laughs> Last night, things took a turn for the worse. I thought that, despite my amnesia, I still managed to have some control over my life until a gift in the mailbox decided otherwise. An envelope with just my name on it, no sender info, no nothing. It had a small device that released an orange gas that knocked me out right away. I'm suddenly someone's target and I don't know why. Could it be from the same person who keeps writing those graffiti messages? This morning I woke up dizzy, and from there a chain of hallucinations overtook me. A woman in the mirror, ram random images that made no sense whatsoever. It even broke the link between my thoughts and those objects. Now I have to listen to my own irritating voice. I don't like it. It makes me feel naked and in total loss of the thing of the little control I had over my mind. At first, I thought there wasn't a single soul I met this past year who would want to hurt me, that it has to be someone from my foggy and probably shady past, and that I must have done something indefensibly wrong to deserve such a punishment. Now I trust no one from the past or the present. Shad says if it's easier for her, I don't see an issue. See, Shad's loves me. Shad's is on my side. He is, he is a champion for me figuring out food. He's been very helpful. It's it helps to have to have a chef on your on on your friend list. You know what I mean? <laughs> There's lots of foods I wish I could have, but I cannot. I was never a picky eater, so these food sensitivities really got me in a bad way. I can only imagine goats. I feel so bad for you. Like certain things when I'm like talking about food that I love that I just got or something, and I know like it's something that you can't have, or like you like mention it or whatever. I'm like poor coats like that's like it's sad we get deprived of like one of the joys in life i just want you to enjoy all the foods that's why i post so much in discord i appreciate the pictures i appreciate the pictures very much caleb don't stop don't stop posting them they do make me extremely jealous but i appreciate them they do inspire me to eat better so there's that I tried to carry on with my daily routine and totally forgot about my new housemate until I saw his post on the fridge. Oh, also I posted, I did post a picture of the lunch I had yesterday. It was like uh, grilled cheese and tomato bisque. It just was like really pretty. <laughs> it was really good too, but. <laughs> um, so I did post a picture in the food section for you as well, Caleb, since you always post them. Wait, what do we do? Why'd you put that idea in my head? I Oh, next thing I know, my DMs will be flooded with bacon and pancakes. Oh my gosh. That's so sweet. Yeah, I, I sent you picture back for once. I finally had a meal like worthy of posting. <laughs> His manners are a little rough around the edges, but I think I'll think about that later. The important thing is that he was also affected by the orange gas and it looks like it messed with his mind as well. We're both alive at least, but I still don't know if those effects are life threatening. I really must find a way to figure out who sent it and why. Maybe I should tell Drake about it. A watchful eye at night would be very helpful. All meals are worthy. Fair enough. Fair enough. To make my already rising paranoia worse, I found this strange beeping device hidden in a nest sitting on the windowsill outside our building floor. Haven't got a clue what that could possibly be. Decided to take the collected rent money to Ham and pay her a visit to see if I could meet her properly in person. Thought I'd take advantage of having to make that exhausting trip and mention the possibility of installing CCTV in the building. But she had, was in a yoga class and the mysterious pillow reader was too busy. Never saw him or her either. Is it Ham too? What a multitasker. And at her age, never ceases to amaze me. Yeah, Shad says as long as it gets you to eat, you can microwave bacon. See? Shad's is on my side. 
I went to tell on you and saw Shadow doing it and said, I, that's what I'm saying. I, I told you Shad's would be like goats and champion me for just making sure I get sustenance. I'm just saying, I called it. I know my people. <laughs> anyway, I left the rent money and did something I'm not very proud of. But like I said, I'm trusting no one and I need to know who's on my tail and why. So I searched your office and found several interesting leads I'm going to follow. I got the chance to check Ham's personal information, but most of the binders were empty. I believe she was friends with Drake's mother and Sophia from an early age, and I still managed to find some interesting leads I could follow to learn a little bit more about Ham. I feel guilty thinking ill of the person who saved me, but I still don't know why she did it or if I can trust her. See how many bits to change Shad's mind? No! No, Shad's won't change his mind. I'm, I'm saying Shad's won't change his mind. Shad's can't be bought. Our our friendship goes deeper. He's got my he's got my back and my well being in mind. Shad is like the one person that I can probably fully trust with that. And I'm gonna hate myself when he changes his mind to make a joke because you gave him bits. <laughs> but I'm 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 saying it here and now though that Shad's won't change his mind because. He knows that it's genuinely an issue and he wants me to succeed at eating. So like eating microwave bacon hurts no one. Thank you. See? So you don't trust us. Wait, why don't I trust you? Oh, because I trust Shad. No. <laughs> Y'all are trying to convince Shads that I shouldn't be doing the things that are take. I don't even eat bacon. I haven't made bacon in so long. Why are we even having this conversation? No. No. At the bus stop on my way to the center, I noticed a black unmarked van parked on the other side of the road. I could swear the same van was waiting outside the center when I left. It sped off, and my one good eye didn't have time to catch the license plate. I'm now 99% sure I'm being watched or having hyper-realistic hallucinations about being watched. What was that clip? Are you sending that to Shads? Are you sending that to Shads after he changes his mind? That's probably what's happening, isn't it? Oh, I forgot. My only jacket is in Ham's center. Damn it. Let's see how tomorrow goes. Flows. Good night. I've sent it why maybe I should tell Drake about it. What was my other option? Chance to check Ham's personal information. Uh, no, I'd rather this note it's all fair game listen Sally do not cook much I can do a little bit it's been a time issue for me that's yes even just streaming is like a major time suck honestly I love it but it's just very hard for me to get cooking done Sporos Ambrosia Park Oriel City Post photographers James Maverick Hamilton Davis Hamilton Kindis Okay. We took the red to ham. Okay. My throat is still like has such a tickle in it right now. I need to open Chad's stream and listen to what he's saying to y'all because now I'm getting nervous that I just put so much faith in him. I still I still hold that the only way he would change his mind, that he would say something different, is if he's joking for the bits. Bit. If it's a bit, for the bits, is what I'm trying to say. I don't think he would change his mind any other reason. I know he wouldn't change his mind any other reason. First, I need to get a crockpot. I don't have a crockpot either. I have a uh, um, Instant Pot. I like my Instant Pot a lot. He hasn't said anything beyond what I posted? Okay, great. Perfect. Love that. Oh, I can pick, like, which corner I put it in? I want it there, like, every time. I thought y'all were trying to get him to change his mind. Music is a vibe. Shad is playing Conan Exiles. Shads is streaming right now. Go see Shads. Shads is a very good friend of mine. 
He's wonderful. Go see him. Go say hi. Tell him thank you for taking care of Sneaky. Already? I thought I still had at least four days before my next fix. Saving Grace, America's most glamorous, sexy female, sexiest female super? The hell? I only asked a question. I ain't here to break anyone's brains. Okay, great. I only have a handful of Instant Pot recipes. Typically, they can be made pretty similarly, honestly. It just is faster. Sometimes you have to like brown the meat before, partially brown the meat beforehand so it all cooks at the same speed, but most of it I've been able to convert. Why is everything in black and white? I can learn almost anything at the speed of light, but couldn't manage to memorize this measly timetable. Shame on me. Bear Hug Garden Shadow Park. Wait, what am I supposed- oh, am I picking one or the other? I don't even remember what day it is. Shoot. Shoot. What day is it? Let's run a shadow park. Oh no, I can click on both and decide. Blood boast donation. I sure do hope this one's open. Can't see the schedule under the blood stain. Why am I so careless sometimes? This walk in the park will be anything but a walk in the park. I hope I chose right. Now I'm nervous. Um, read the note. That's what we need to do. Oh. Took a lot of effort to reach that sticky note and pull it towards me. Hi, Drake. The orange gas was a cruel joke sent by some anonymous prick who, besides knocking me out, gave me a full day of hallucinations and disorientation. I'm sorry I hurt you too, but you were the collateral damage. It wasn't. Me it was meant for me, but I don't know who would wish me harm or why. I'm following some leads and I'll do my best to find out who sent that device. In the meantime, maybe you should go visit a doctor, and please let me know if you see something sp suspicious around our building. Frank. <laughs> what happened to the good old harmless pranks? I think I lingered in the woods for far too many moons. I'm too out of touch, out of blood, and out of energy to endure such a world. And seeing a doctor would lead to complete havoc and chaos. The world is not ready for my level of freaky. How did that hurt her? I thought that would help our relationship. Oh my gosh. Okay. We're just not gonna- this- this playthrough is just not gonna equal friendship. That's just- we're just gonna accept that and move on. Anywho, I'm gonna head to bed, gonna get up early tomorrow. Night, sleep well, Lulu. Thanks so much for hanging out. Thanks for chatting food and recipes and things. I appreciate you. I hope you get some good sleep and I hope- is- uh, do the kids go to school tomorrow? Or later this week? Healthy pa. Oh, I made a few meals in my life. I, I, I learned to make like chili and spaghetti and like spaghetti with hamburger meat and uh, mac and cheese and like a few different things like that like skillet meals i loved cooking those for us growing up this is definitely different than other games you always find the most interesting and random ones i do i i like pride myself on finding random games like there's just so many really cool and really unique games by indie developers like that just need attention and i'm like if i could just share if i could just share these games with a few people who find them interesting it just like makes me very happy First day tomorrow, that's why I'm getting up early. Makes sense. Gonna make a pancakes with bacon? With bacon? Eh, 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 eh. Oh, okay. Yeah, that was weird. Anyway, thanks for hanging out. Sleep well. I hope that the kids have a great first day tomorrow, for reals. Good luck to them. Cooking is great when it comes out well and people praise you, but it wears me 
idea about I'd rather bake. I'm the opposite. I'd rather like actively cook than bake. I knocked out one of my lights. Please come back. Please come back. I need to buy a new ring light, I think. This one like is very, very touchy about everything. I don't even know where it's plugged in at. Please hold while your party is reached. Oh, I like, did I like unplug, unplug it? Probably. Ah, we're back. That might be too bright though. That's definitely too bright. It's hurting my eyes. Uh, gotta put bacon in the fridge to thaw. Fingers crossed it'll be thawed in the morning. There you go, perfect. Perfect. Well, good luck. Good luck to you and to them as well. The new schedule way is a little rough. I'm just a foodie that can kind of cook, but would rather not, only for special occasions. Which, honestly, if you budget well, like, something I've learned just in, like, the inability to cook for a while for mental health things, like, if you budget it well and you plan out what you need, like, if you eat out one meal a day, it's not horribly expensive compared to what you'd pay for groceries. Like, I, so I buy, like, the shakes and, like, granola bar things, protein bars for breakfast, and then I get something, usually I get just grocery store stuff for lunch, like sandwich stuff or chicken salad or something like that. Um, and, like, a chips, something basic and not the most healthy, but if you do that and then you eat, like, one meal out and you're conscious of what you're doing, like, you're not going out for, like, major meals and apps and drinks all the time, then it's not so bad. So it is possible to do, and like, I'll always suggest, like if you're struggling with your mental health and you need like a little bit of leeway so you can spend your spoons elsewhere, <laughs> if you need your spoons for things other than figuring out food, like I would recommend it. But it's very hard to go back to cooking afterwards, I will say. One more question, why red and blue lights in the background? I've seen other streamers use those colors. So technically this one's orange and this one's teal there. Um, orange, because orange is my color, I wanted a complementary color, which is teal. Um, and they just usually look good together, which is why a lot of people do red. It's usually a deep red and a deep blue. So mine's a little bit of a change up of it, but it's usually just a good, it's a good contrast for skin and like, it just looks the best when you're trying to go for the darker colors. I don't know if that makes any sense, but I did think through it a lot <laughs> and I may change it eventually. But when I just had orange, like it just blended with my skin. So it was really hard to balance and it's still really hard to balance. But some of the, so having some of the blue kind of makes it pop a little bit. My office is actually has teal things in it. So other than my orange thing. So now it's teal and orange anyway, so it works <laughs> random. Like so many other things, it remained a secret how mom got me this access to blood banks around the city. But it's been working fine. Nobody ever, nobody ever asked me any questions. What am I supposed to be doing? The vibes get real. Oh, makes sense. I liked it. Just curious. Yeah, no problem. Happy to answer any questions. Now I sleep, sleep well. Sleep, sleep very well, Lulu. I'm sure we'll talk tomorrow. Keep me updated on how the kids do with school. I'd love to hear about it. About the day. Bye. What the heck am I supposed to do with this? <laughs> oh, 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 no, I clicked out of the game. Do I have to go very slowly? Like, what am I doing wrong? <laughs> oh, there's a scanning bar. Found it. Found it. Uh. Did I get it? Oh my gosh. <laughs> that one made me feel dumb. I feel like I should have figured that out easier. Don't blame me one bit. Uh. Oh yeah, for the cookie. Okay, then the usual, usual modest operandi. Take a little bit from the blood type with the most stock. That way they never notice and I don't interfere with the blood supply because we all know that donating blood saves lives. Donate blood. If you can donate blood, please do. Mine included. Take a little bit of blood from the 
bow stock, which I guess they don't really give me an option. Oh, and they do. We've got A plus, A, B plus. Oh, neg, O positive, A, B plus. Interesting, interesting, okay. A, B plus it is. Yep. Oh, there we go. Wait. Is that it? Am I supposed to take it from all of them? You're giving you're giving Barry all the emotions. Chaos. Absolute chaos. Am I... Apparently, I apparently have one of the rarest blood types. I can transfuse my blood to anyone, but they can't to me. Uh, what is your, uh, what's your blood type? I'm O neg, but O positive is like one of the can almost give to everybody, right? Is it the, uh... Oh, shoot, I can't remember. I used to know this for nursing school. Unless they have that blood type. Yeah. Why can't I get this to connect? There we go. Now we're good. Now we're good. Okay, okay, okay. There's a new blood type they just found this year, and only 30 people are believed to have it. Wait, what's that? Also, I'm concerned about what's going on with, uh, Drake. Like, Drake has, like, a nomadic life and is having to get into blood banks for blood. And, like, I'm wondering why, what's causing that. I can't remember what they called it. I think it was PV or something. Hmm. I didn't know that. AB positive. I forgot. It's on the sheet of paper. I'm not sure. When I donated blood, they were actually very happy I was donating to find out my blood type. Oh, for sure. For sure, because it can go anywhere. May have a disease or something? Yeah, I think so. I'm just not sure. I'm just trying to, like, think through what it could be. But my brain's not landing on anything. On the roof? What are we doing on the roof? Guess the movie. Oh my gosh, all these movie cards and I don't know. Tomorrow the birds will sing. The tramp. Am I supposed to know these? Because I don't. <laughs> I'm seeing on top of this sign. That's gonna be that's gonna be hot, like, right? Gotta love it. For sure. I feel on top of my game more than ever, to be honest, and I feel different as well. thought that would happen again. Is it the tramp Charlie Chaplin's character? I don't know, honestly. I can only do two squares. Oh, that one will take that one out. Okay. I can do two squares of this one as well. This one and this one. Oh no, because that turns that one on. Okay. So the lines tells me what can work. If I go here and then here, no. If I go here and then here, I can't cross that same line. Almost forgot my shoes. Snatch your shoes. Don't forget. Darn, no, because then it... Okay. Okay, so as long as I don't touch those, that's all I gotta do. Oh my gosh. Why did that take me so long? <laughs> oh. I didn't, I d didn't fully understand that until that moment. Hello there, little vest pocket. Happy to see me again. 
This footloose worker, great Ock, soldier of the road, is always tickled to death when his services are requested to get your little ass out of trouble. I'm here as your mama's call boy to deliver an important message to you from beyond. You must return to your old house, and you're finally granted a free pass into the forbidden attic. Isn't that swell? I don't know. She says she kept important information from you, thinking she was doing the right thing. Now she knows she wasn't. Time for me to hit the road. So long. Such, like, weird... Like, where is this ghost spirit thing coming from? This is really happening. I'm a ghost whisperer, a living crystal ball, a badly dressed clairvoyant, and one step closer to cutting my last thin tether to this world. So... So interesting. Drake is like very poetic, but I can't like figure out what's actually going on with him. Beyond the wild wood comes the wide world. And I don't know what the rat is, but definitely likes quoting the rat. So the rat is influential. Today I woke up with a need ahead of time and I think the orange gas was responsible for it. It drained my vitality and weakened my senses to the bare minimum. It left me only enough time to check Frank's sticky note and head straight to the blood bank bus. But everything went quite smoothly and I was myself again in no time, if not stronger than before. So I decided to skip work and make better use of my energy beats, serving beers and cleaning up vomit. I was on the building rooftop testing my sight, smell, and hearing range when your hobo friend made a flashy appearance in the sky. I was told I must go to our old house due to important information that lies in the attic. My forbidden place. I never had the slightest interest in checking it out. I always found it creepy and foul smelling. But now you're forcing me to go. Even in death, you're still difficult to understand, mother. On my way back to the apartment, eager to quickly return the keys to the rooftop I had stolen from Frank, I heard noises come from inside apartment 3B. The full mailbox, no doormat, absence of pictures on the bulletin board made me think it was vacant. Strange. You see, now I'm 100% sure I saw you at the cemetery, but I couldn't muster the courage to go and see you tonight. I do see ghosts, and you are indeed trying to tell me something, but I'm still not sure if I want to know. Changing the subject to one of more of a more earthly kind, Frank and I began a little relationship through sticky notes. Isn't that romantic? It appears that gas was meant to hurt him, and I was just collateral damage. Is it just a coincidence that something so treacherous happened the day I arrived? Who knows? He asked for help with his investigation, and I'm all in. But I won't tell him what effect it had on me. I can't trust him yet. Nor can I tell him why I can't go to the doctor. The first and only time we did that, we ended up hightailing it into the middle of the night to escape the monster hunters. Good night, mother. Sleep in peace. Hmm. We do some podcasts? What do you mean? What you mean, Snapple? First creature of the night. Deer, Servide, hooved grazing mammal. Weird fact, some species of the deer have been recorded on film eating infant birds, which is weird as a deer is primarily herbivores. A voice, like you like what I'm reading, is that what you're saying? <laughs> Overheard in Shadow Park. I can't be around people right now. I'm telling you, man, the moon is a hoax, a scam. It was created to distract the general masses from the existence of this planet. I don't remember the name of that is about to crash into the earth. I want to go get married right now and have like seven kids and make the first mixed team, all brothers and sisters of ultimate frisbee. This was all said by the same person in a minute, a matter of six minutes. Little Lauren Swingy, you must return to your old house bits and parts of soul. You did thirst for blood, and with blood I fill you. Dante Inferno. I used to do podcasts. What kind of podcasts did you do, goats? Did I know that? I feel like you may have told me that before, but I don't remember. Ooh. 919, day three. I think this is probably where I'm gonna stop for the night because we have been doing, we did about a little over three hours and my throat is hurting. So I think we'll be done for tonight, but we will be back on Thursday. Let me play music, we'll find a raid. We'll go hang out with some fun friends. 
Maybe Shads. I really have learned to like this song a lot. He died to bed soon anyway. Yeah, me too. I'm trying to go to bed earlier, so I'm trying to get off stream a little earlier. With the walking dead. Uh it's good to hang out with you as well, Ghost. Thanks for being here. I appreciate it. I hope y'all enjoyed this game. Or at least are enjoying hanging out while I play this game. <laughs> I'm enjoying it. So I guess that's that's at least important. I'm enjoying it. Oh, you heard my voice. That's awkward. And I close out of the tab. Gosh dang it. It's been an interesting piece, to say the least. Oh, for sure. It's definitely... Gosh dang it. I can't seem to mute the tab. <laughs> Sound like it was part of the song. Well, that's good. Always enjoy hanging out. Thanks, Reaper. I enjoy hanging out with you. It's always a good time. I appreciate y'all so much. You have no idea. <laughs> let's see. Should we? Let's raid Shads. Did we raid Shads last stream though? We raided Sadie last stream. We're gonna raid Shads anyway. I've already decided. We could talk more about bacon. I mean. The best, right? I didn't that need to open. Virtual. Oops, sorry, that's Chad's voice. I didn't open the tab properly. Um, okay, yes, yeah, so as Reaper is sharing, grab yourself a raid message. Glad I caught you on. I'm so glad that you were here, Snapple, and um, that you were able able to hang out. It was fun chatting with you about the game, for sure, and all the things. I appreciate you. I love you, Alice! Thank you for being here! <laughs> All right, grab your raid message. Make sure you copy it. I think I copied mine. Um, grab your raid message. Check out my TikTok. I pinned it at the top, but uh, Reaper just shared it. I'm trying to do better at all the socials, so primarily Twitter or X, Instagram, and TikTok. So probably in that order, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. But so yes, and also join the Discord if you're not in the Discord. I'd love to have you in the Discord. I always stream two days a week, Mondays and Thursdays at 6:30 p.m. Central. I just realized I'm not on my chatting screen. Um, uh, so most of our community happens outside of that. We do a lot of chatting in Discord throughout the day and hanging out a lot. Um, I've been playing a lot of Palea in the Discord for people to hang out with, um, things like that. So feel free to join us. We'd love to have you. Um, yeah, check out my other socials. But otherwise, we are going to do our usual reminders and affirmations. Um, then we'll move to thank yous and we'll go ahead and raid chats. So make sure you have that message, but let me get the raid started real fast. This music is such a vibe. I love this playlist. I just put awesome instead of Aussie. So there's that. My brain's working really great. Um, okay, I'm sorry this raid. So let's do some writing and affirmation. So take a moment to recognize how you're feeling every single day. Get your body moving, even if it's in a small way. Connect with others who bring you joy. Be intentional about learning something new every single week. Give back to others when you feel like you can, but always remember that you're important and you're loved, especially here. Let's do those thank yous. <laughs> let's go. Make sure you see that raid message if you don't, or the raid thing if you don't, make sure you're fresh so you can go with us. But thank you to my mods, Starfish, Shadow Reaper. Thank you so much for your help tonight. Thank you to our gifted subs to Bacon and Bacon Pancakes from Caleb. Caleb, thank you so much for resubscribing for your 10th month, Irish Snapple for third, and Reaper for your 17th. Caleb, again, thank you for the gifted subs. And Snapple, thank you so much for the 100 biddies. I appreciate the heck out of y'all, whether you're just here hanging out, whether you're lurking, whether you are gifting one thing or another. I appreciate you so much. Y'all are the very best. And I will see you again on Thursday at 6.30 p.m. Central. Bye, y'all.